Are you guys ready? Let's do this. Yeah. Um, yes. Just, just uh, before we begin, I have two things I wanted to say. Um, you all so... suck. <laughs> You're so mean. <laughs> um, no, it was just because uh, last time we uh, left, just before you guys were doing a short rest, I just wanted to uh, say that, like, to wait until I say that you have actually completed a short rest to, like, fill your hit dice and stuff like that. Oh, click on the button. Yeah. It's just that uh, it, some things could happen that uh, you don't complete your short rest, especially in a dungeon um, <laughs> in the middle of a room with skeleton. Have um, we completed the short rest? Have we did that? Did we do that uh, last last time? Well, we you guys mentioned you wanted to uh, do a short rest. I think Fern applied it. Um, Me too. And I might have applied it. If everybody yeah. applied it, I might have applied it as well. <laughs> but it, it all went pretty fast. I, I just wanted to bring it up so that uh, I have a chance to do something if something should happen yeah, in, a, in an hour. Of... You up. <laughs> <laughs> um, and the other thing is that, uh, like, thinking back to the uh, last session, um, like I would like to use the map more for like the combat because it's easier to track people and do the initiative and all that. But like when we're actually like walking in the dungeon and stuff like that, uh, I would like to be more like a role play base that you guys don't start like moving all your character over the place, but just uh, more uh, say what you want to do so that we can do like step by step each per person uh, at a time. Even um, in a dungeon crawl uh, moment. Oh, okay, so like turn by turn, I'm going there, and then we move the character there. Yeah. All over. Yeah. Because uh, just to try and uh, avoid stuff like um, Fern stepping on a bridge just with his um, token. Big self. And like every everyone doing different things. So if you want me to describe more stuff in in the room, like, because uh, at the same time, the map is just a drawing, but there may, like, I don't want you to rely too much on, on it and more like ask me uh, what you guys see, how many entrances is there, where can I go, uh, that kind of stuff. And uh, keep the map more combat uh, support than uh, anything else. Okay. Uh, we'll refine it. I, I just wanted to. Uh, to say that because uh, last time I just felt a bit overwhelmed with everything that was happening. It was hard to track and say what was actually going on. Yeah, of course. All right. <laughs> I can understand. Somebody's going to die tonight for that. I can <laughs> feel it. Um, so let's jump into it. Um, so, last session. Uh, you guys uh, started in the inn uh, discussing on your next move uh, after talking with uh, Peter. You uh, decided to um, raid the, the manor, so you went on with Peter, uh, asked him to bring you guys to the secret entrance that he mentioned. Then uh, you attempt to draw a map of um, what it, it, what the manner looked like, um, thing that you could have done with paper back in the end, but you decided to do a true magic and um, back to back uh, talking about it, which was working but tedious at the same time. Um, so you just ended up uh, getting a rough idea and going straight in. Um, when you enter the, the first room, you um you were in the the room with uh, a creature that started talking into fern's head uh where he proceeded to uh throw the throw um semat's chicken at it so that uh you could distract him while he was eating 
and you guys just ran past him. Um, and then you, in your hurry, in your hurry to uh, take this opportunity of the monster eating the chicken, uh, Fern stepped on a bridge that couldn't uh, hold his weight, and he fall down, uh, taking some damage. Uh, you guys were able to bring him, him back up, and you decided to make your way down uh, some stairs where there was uh, two doors. Um, you decided to go in the door that uh, had some bubbling and dripping sound where you found uh, a rat that, uh, that Fern proceeded to kill abruptly. Um, and instead of uh, you finding corpse of a rat, it just vanishes. Um, um, and then uh, you you proceeded to the next room where you found some papers on the desk uh, in a room that resemble uh, the the chambers of a wizard. Uh, the letter revealed that uh, Yarno was most likely. Last stuff. Um, you then uh, proceeded to find multiple secret secret door with a uh, great investigation uh, that led you guys to a crypt where you were greeted by a skeleton, which Semat rushed and uh, the the combat started. You guys dispatched the skeleton pretty well with a good synergy and prepared for a short rest in uh, inside the room with the dead skeleton. Samet uh, gathering uh, and um, putting to rest the skeletons. Um, so yeah, that's where we left off. So at that point, uh, when you guys are kind of settling down and it's becoming quieter in, oh, I'm not in the street. I don't have the music. Nice. All right. So yeah, when, when it's becoming quieter because you guys are uh, taking some time to breathe, taking a, a short rest uh, while Sam is doing his thing, um, you hear the the door right next here just uh, crack open. Like not crack, but like, and everyone. Sound? Uh, no, it's the door uh, just opening with not enough uh, grease, or I don't know. <laughs> I'm just, Creaking I'm just <laughs> and um, yeah, with your passive perception, uh, it, it just seemed like someone is trying to peek inside the uh, the room, and everyone notices it because the door is making such a huge noise. What are you guys doing? I'm trying to perceive. Perceive? Uh, yeah. And make your... Uh, well, I mean, you, you already... Looking... You, if you already notice uh, the door opening. And you just... But who's it, 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 the door? But we have, uh, we have the moment for for like a, I don't know hide. Uh, well, at the time when the door opens, everyone like you it, you see a human. Uh, like if anyone that has currently um, like sight to the door, you just see a, a, like a human peeking through the door, and he sees you guys. You see them. Um, what does it look like? Well, make a perception check. You want more details? Perception! First roll of the night. That's my music. That's the map. Where's my character sheet? That's the map. Where's the map? Here. Here's my. But um, it's uh, twenty-two. My, nice. Um. Well, I mean, you, you, he, he seems like a red brand. Like, uh, you, it's a human. Uh, you, you 
with your perception, you catch a glimpse of some red uh, clothing, like maybe a, a, a scarf or a hood. Um, yeah. Can I try to dash and grab him? Um, I mean, you, you would have to open the door and... Uh... Okay, he's just, he's peeking through the door. He's not opening it. Um, where, yeah. where is the door? It's uh, yeah, this one. Top, top right. Oh, top right. Oh, that's a door. Yep. Oh, so there's two other doors here. Mm -hmm. yeah, yes. I think the bottom one is like a big one with two doors. So yeah, it's I bigger try door. To open the door and grab him. Like. Mm. Yeah, it's the top one. You have to run. I dash. I got long legs. Huh. Uh, you, yeah, you can uh, dash and try to grab him. So uh, make a make a strain check, I think. It's a, a athletic versus athletic or acrobat. Uh, athletic, yeah. For grapple yeah. check. Sure. I know that hard now. The goddamn rule. Now. I have twenty one. It's the full uh, damage and concentration check I have to remember now. So as the um as, as you uh dash and burst the door open, you see uh, uh you see two red brands on the other side and you try to grab one, but uh like E he, he was able to see you coming, and he just pushes you back. Shoot. And at this point, I'll ask you guys to roll initiative. So did we, or did we not, have a short rest? Um, I'll give it to you guys, because you already applied it. But Because um, we're awesome. But not for yeah. the next time. <laughs> and, and no, well, well I mean... Some respective, uh, you could say. We've been good people. Best player you <laughs> ever had. The only player you have ever had. Yes, yes to all those questions, but that's not why I give it to you guys. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, two, four. I know. Oh my god. Uh, Nine. Okay. I got eighteen. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Oh, uh, wait. Tamara, you said seven. four? So seven? we're rolling initiative? Uh, I, I forget initiative. the... Yes. The Fine. Fine. Nine. Sorry? Don't Fine, say. nine? Yeah. Nine. Nine. Uh, seven. So you're still at seven, oh, seven. Tamara, right? What? Was yeah. Seven. Is the music okay? Battle sequence. Yeah. Well, I it is it side, yeah. perfect. Muy bien, muy bien. Oops. Sorry, uh, Tamara. It, it happens. So, Kaden, uh, Samat, I'm still waiting on your initiative. Still waiting on you. I got 18. Wow. I yeah. usually play like um, dexterity based characters. And I'm used to having high initiative, now I, I kind of suck at it. What do you mean? You, you never play. I, I played before a lot. <laughs> My wife was a DM. Your what? My wife. Oh yeah, true. Um... Oh, they rolled zero. Excellent. No, they roll. Four. Well, that's good. Uh, <laughs> would I be the front line since I try to grab them? Yep. Okay. Uh, actually, like you can. Uh, where do you guys want to be? Like, where would would you guys be uh, during your short rest? Um, well, the sh from my short rest, it was mostly praying. So yeah. That's what we said. Like I was uh, kind of praying for them. Mm 
pray for their souls. No, but I mean, where do you want to be uh, on? Where would you have been on the map uh, while resting? While resting? I mean, I think right there is okay. And where am I? In my turn, I'm going to advance. All right. So if you guys are fine with your position, um, yeah. So Cade, you're the you're the first one. Of course, I would have been here. <laughs> <laughs> Just resting inside the other room. Uh huh. Makes sense. Uh, I'm gonna move here. All right. And I'm gonna shoot with my crossbow. All right. All right. You have a crossbow now. I forgot about that. Yeah. Roll for attack. Does yeah. it give? Does it give? Uh, I I know we talked about it last time, but uh, does it give partial cover if there is someone in front? Uh, an enemy? I think so. No, but it's a friendly. It's not enemy. You Means like if, shooting if, if he shoots allies. through me, yeah. Okay. Without disadvantage. I think. I think it's always been a gray area. Yeah. I'll, I'll do some research while you fight. For, for, for now, just do it uh, straight roll. I got 16. Uh, that hits. Hits. Roll for damage. Damage. With uh, sneak attack. Damage. Do I have sneak attack? You do because Fern yeah, is do. uh in uh, melee range. The guy. This. How much? Six? Ten. Sorry. No. <laughs> ten. <laughs> Four ten? English. Yeah, ten. That's great. Oh. Uh, so, yeah, you... <laughs> you, uh, you go behind Fern as soon as he, uh, uh, like, get up and start dashing like a crazy man. And uh, you manage to find an opening in between him trying to grapple the uh, other guy. And you, you shoot him right in the, uh, uh, the leg. And he looks <laughs> like he looks hurt. That arrow was well placed. Um, so yeah, uh, is that your turn? Uh, yes, that's all. So Matt, you're up. Um. And Fern, you're next. Yes. I'll prepare my okay. spells. So since uh, so uh, what I'll do is I'll Mm hmm. <laughs> mm hmm. I'm thinking about. So Fern already went. Okay. Went in combat. So what I'll do or... is I'll I'll uh, I'll come here and I'll do. Um... A guiding bolt. All right. Guiding ball to that guy. Did he take damage? Hmm. He did. Yes. A lot or not? Bam. A well placed arrow in the leg, oh. right in the uh, the, the ham is part of the leg. Real hurt or? It, it, it did uh, quite a bit of damage. 
Okay, so I will not do it on him. Uh, and I don't have light enough sight, so what I'll do is uh, actually a Sacred Flame. He has to make a... a no, Toll of the Dead. He has... To, mm, Dex or Wisdom. Toll of the Dead. He has to make a Wisdom saving throw. Same guy that got hurt? Yep. Wisdom is Charisma, right? Wisdom, uh, wisdom is yeah. curious. No, wisdom is wisdom. No, wisdom is yeah, wisdom. wisdom. Yeah, wisdom. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know why. Uh, that's uh, natural one minus one, so zero. Mm. Roll damage. Three. Yeah, one d eight is gonna stay one d eight. All right. So, so you, uh... yeah, and I'm staying here. Um, and I'm screaming, uh, Fern, come back here. All right. So it, it was turn the dead or uh, not turn the dead, oh. but um, what was the spell? Secret flame or the other the one? Dead. Told the dead. Told the dead. Basically, you know, I'm making a, a like a, a dark prayer with a low, low voice and through the skull. Uh, that is my uh, holy symbol. There's a, a kind of a vapor while bells can be heard, and so the, the the ground trembles a bit. Just one, once, twice, maybe a third time, and that comes and grasp the up to the bones of the uh, enemy. All right. So yeah, um, just it's after you damage. All right. Oh. Just after he uh, gets hit in the legs, you uh, Semad just like start mumbling uh, weird stuff, and it's like in Yu-Gi-Oh, where like the uh, uh, soul is broken, like just uh, the color breaks, <laughs> and he just seems to um, get really hurt. And right now he's not feeling well. It's uh, it's not going well for him. All right. So that finished them at stern. It's burn. Yeah, yeah. Um Tamara, you're next. Okay. Oh, I thought Fern went already. Shit. Nope. Nope. Well, okay. Uh, uh just keep shooting them. I'll hold them off and I'm going to cast uh Blade Ward. On You're myself. holding the guy? I'll Sorry? hold them off. No, I'm not holding them physically. I'll just hold them in place, block the door, basically. Oh, okay. Do you still have a shield? I, st I still have a shield, yeah. Okay. Yeah, so I'm casting uh, Blade Ward on myself. What's What does that do again? I trace a sigil of warding in the air until the end of your of my next turn. I have resistance against bludgeoning, piercing, slashing damage dealt by weapon attacks. Nice. So I'm basically I'm impervious to weapons. Unless it's magical, right. but anyway. Okay. That is my uh, turn. Maybe wait, maybe that will I don't know if you wanna keep Ignoring the cover, but I found the answer to cover. So if you want to do this right now or after the fight, I don't mind. Uh, let's do it after the fight. Uh, all right. So as the guy is just like beaten by uh, Kade and Semat, uh, um, Fern, you just like uh, pick uh, your sword in the ground, start drawing symbols and mumbling some words. And uh, the guy is just looking at you. He he seems confused at that point, and like uh, everything is going down for him. <laughs> All right, so uh, that's the turn. That's uh, Tamara's turn now. So I'm going to advance here, and because I can't, I I can just uh, get a little closer. So I'm going to attack with my crossbow. Okay. Ooh. Shit. Uh, seven. Seven. You you shoot and like with everything happening, 
uh it, it just like um it, it's a pretty new crossbow so you're just uh starting like learning the ropes of it and all uh and it just goes wide and it misses okay and i don't have right now two weapons fight because i don't have two crossbows so i think it's a two yeah. all right i think it's a two-ended crossbow anyway so yep. uh, yeah but i have just one mm -hmm. you, you well you have to well i mean you could have picked up two crossbows but uh, the light crossbow is two-ended so you cannot wield two light crossbow oh, okay you need a um, hand crossbow i think which are hand yeah. crossbow yeah okay because i have a crossbow a light crossbow so that's what but you I picked just up take one. The... yeah but i just take one yeah but you can't one. wheel two so okay. okay even if you would have picked two i don't it's know you ended. would so you, uh, you would still ended, just so I can, yeah yeah go see I can the do it again in the in the properties you see ammunition loading range it's two-handed that means you need two hands to manipulate it Ooh, to use it okay 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 get it so, and yeah. because of loading you cannot uh use two uh, attack, two attack. Yeah. okay okay i get it huh thank you <laughs> you have okay. to load it with a bonus action or something. Or, uh, yeah, but, uh, but I, uh, with, in my bonus action, there is just uh, uh, action in combat, two weapons fighting. I I think it's just for uh, swords or uh, daggers. So, yeah. Yeah, I think it's melee weapon. Mm -hmm. yeah, All right. That's my turn. That's your turn? Yeah. So now it's... Um... The um, it's the other guy turn, so he's gonna go ahead and um, try to save his life by killing the first thing in front of him. So he's gonna take uh, these guys make two attacks, so he's gonna make two uh, melee attack on uh, uh ferns. Where's my d20? It's here. So he's using his short sword. That's 19 to hit. 19 hits. The first one. Um, it's five hit points. But that would be reflected okay. with Blade Ward, right? Oh yeah, yeah. so it's uh, five half. So it's two damage. It's half? Yeah, resistance is uh, half damage. Okay. Im immune is uh, zero, but resistance is uh, uh, half damage. I did you round it down? Round it down. So Sorry. two. Yep. Next one is fourteen to 14 hit. Fourteen misses. All right. Um. Then he's going to move here and uh, move to the turn of the other guys that he's going to move in front of you, trying to protect his friend and attack you again with two attacks. First one is 20 to hit. 20 hits. And it's um, 7 slashing damage reduced to 3. Man, that thing is... And it works for the whole round, it's not just one time. You mean well, my... The Blade your War? Resistance. Yeah. Uh, it's until the end of your next turn. So when my next turn ends, Blade War uh, drops. That's crazy. Uh, wait, I didn't do... How much was it, the second one? It's a one? tank spell. Uh, was it three it's or it was four? Sorry? The second damage, was it's... it three or four? It's three. So it was seven reduced to three. Okay. And last attack is, uh, 
11. Misses. All right, so... So they attack um, twice each, eh? Yep. So, yeah, he, he, the guy trying to, like, just save his life, slash two times, the first time it hits you uh, on, the, on the shoulder, and tries to hit again, uh, but, like, you, you side coming, so you raise your shield, just as you see uh, him duck out of the way, the other guy is coming in front of you and pursing uh, like in your foot, doing some damage while you raise your shield and then tries again. But then you uh, you're able to like just uh, get out of the way, and uh, that's their turn. Moving back to Cade. Yeah. Uh, I'm gonna shoot him with my crossbow again. Can you set up the turn order, uh, Kevin? Sorry? Can you set up the turn order? It is. No, we don't, we see, don't it. see it. We just see the, the red brand. Um, how do I make it? How do I make it? available for you guys because it, it's a uh, it's an option like you guys just have to uh, click on the, the the watch icon in your toolbar don't you guys have it no no it's okay then like on, on the on the left side of the screen, you don't have like a toolbar with an arrow and the thing to draw and stuff like that. Yeah, we do. Yes. Isn't there one that is just a, a clock? Mm, no. No. Okay. okay. Well, I don't know. We only see one guy. Not the what? everybody else's. We, we see the mobs. Oh. Our turn. Okay. I don't know then how okay, to no change it. Yeah, you can say as a bonus our turn. Yeah. Well, uh, right now it's Kate's turn and Samat, you're next. Yeah. yeah so you said you're, you're shooting, shooting him? Shooting, yes. Go for it. Got 16. 16 hits. Oh wait. Put my weapon, what? I got... I got 15. You got... 15? Yeah. 15 also hits. Yay. Okay. Sixteen. Sixteen damage? Yeah. <laughs> this guy is crazy. How? How do you want to, really? how do, you want to do this? I got I got one D eight plus three and two D six. Oh okay. Rogues. <laughs> how do you want to do this? <laughs> I'll shoot him in the head. Yeah, right. I think it was like. So, um. Because it's a sneak attack, okay. Yeah, as, um. Like, when Fern ducks out of the way from the last uh, stroke of this guy, you just take this opportunity and lodge a well placed uh, crossbow bolt right between his high. Like, you couldn't have shot better. And, uh, he just falls on the ground. The other guy uh, just like looking at it, falling like from no damage to dead in a matter of seconds. That's your turn. Yeah, that's all. All right. So one, one shot at a guy. I think that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so that that guy that guy is dead. Yep. Uh, 
I don't have line of sight. So what I'll do is uh, I'll wait until the guy comes back in sight, and I'll use um, uh, I'll, I'll retain my action, launch a another told the bell. Toll the bell. Toll the bell. Bing. Bing. All right. So you old your uh, toll the bell. Toll the dead. I, I got can trips. Good. Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> um. Not not much but, I can do here, guys. That's your turn. Did a great job. Keep it on, son. And I'm just hitting, uh, patting the Kate on the on the shoulder a bit too hard. <laughs> All right, friend starting. Doing six bludgeoning damage <laughs> <laughs> with an unarmed strike. <laughs> um, I'm gonna move in the room. I'm gonna go over there. Hello. Ahoy! So he, he's like, uh, I see he's in the corner. Walk so. on the dead. If I do what? Sorry. Yeah, yeah. I stepped over Walk the other uh, dead guy. Dead. Who cares? I got big legs. Uh, I'll, uh, this time I'll just. Um, Hit him. I'll do. <laughs> do I do that for? I uh, no, no, no. I'll just bash him with a war hammer. As usual. All right, roll for attack. <clears throat> well, no, I'm gonna try to bash him. <laughs> oh my god! Natural one. <laughs> so uh, you you um, you raise your hammer, you enter the room, ready to hit the guy, and you just. Uh, step over like you just like get your fit stuck inside the dead body and fall <laughs> to the ground nice all right that's your turn um yeah because my bonus action kind of sucks so yep all I'll right be back uh saying good night to my kids no Go for it. Your character might be dead over. when you come back. I think so. it's almost over. I uh, will wait until the end of the encounter. No, it was, it was a joke. I don't care. No, 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 no go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, uh, right. I just remembered he's almost finished. It's Tamara's turn. Okay, so I'm going to uh, enter here. Uh, I guess I have a. I'm going to hit the guy with my sword. So. Alright. Sword, sword. Do you Roll what? to attack. Yes. Oh no, man. Seven. Seven. The guy just hangs to like his life like uh never. And he's just tr like moving around trying to uh, get out of the way of all your um your hits and uh, you manage to um, es like excavate the uh, the hit that you're trying to do. Bonus action, the other sword. <laughs> Go for it. Hey, 16. Uh, 16, 16 and... hits. Uh, okay, I have so you... more but whatever. <laughs> Roll for damage, but um, you you don't add the plus. So it's just the... No, just she she yeah, has a I have to, style. to have a uh, have fighting style with two. Oh yeah, true. She's a melee ranger. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Actually, no. you you also uh, I saw that you have a feat for uh, adding damage to people that already lost some HP. Something similar to sneak attack. Like you you can oh. do one one per turn. You have like. Uh... I don't remember how much it is, but not her. She doesn't have feet. Well, no. it may it might not be a feet, but it's a Colossus yeah. Slayer. 
Once per yeah. turn, you hit a creature with a weapon attack. The creature takes an extra 1d8 damage if it's below its HP maximum. So exactly, it's already but... wounded. It takes 1d8. Exactly, but it have to be a creature, not a person or a non-dead. A person is a creature. Uh, yes? Any, any, yeah, anything that has an initiative is a creature. Okay. I, I was thinking you, you like... Got, uh, you got creatures and you got objects. Something. These are the two categories of, of entities in Dungeons & Dragons. Mm, okay. Yep. So, so. but uh, I think uh, the, the, the guy, this was, was the first hit, so... No, th this guy is the the one that is pretty hurt. Oh uh, yeah. Mm, okay. Because <laughs> Kate killed the the one full full HP in one blow, so this one is the guy you already started bashing. Uh, so he's he's oh hurt. So you you okay. can add your uh, D eight on top of your damage. Okay. It's once per turn. Once per so turn. Yeah. Plus one D eight per turn. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> Okay, so I have a 1d6 right now. One. Oh my god. Plus three, four, plus. Uh, it's with any weapon attack. And. Uh, Even range? Yep, any weapon attack. So now I have four plus 1d8, right? Mm hmm. Eight. All right, so 12. <laughs> 12. How do you want to do this? Okay, but I, I, I did a uh, eight. That's all. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So. Uh, well, it, it was, wasn't it uh, four plus eight? Or you rolled? Uh, no, it was, was a four with the okay. with the with the with the d six, and a four with the d eight. I see. Okay. Great. So, but yeah, it, it does it. Oh, yeah, he died. Dead. Okay, um, I'm going just to stab him like. <laughs> stab him real good. Yeah. <laughs> Were right. you making a Did reference you... to the meme? Oh uh, no, I'm not. No, no, uh, I was. Kiddio, yeah, I'll oh, stab him real good. I, I passed. I, I I posted some um uh, uh some D and D memes in uh, the Discord. Okay. So I was referring that, but I, I don't think you guys saw it, except uh, Fern. I saw it. Yeah, that one. It was not in the was, chat, right? It was in uh, Laugh, La Laugh, Laugh and, and Giggles. Giggles. Oh, okay, that's why I don't see it. You guys only read <laughs> the tavern chat? Yeah, <laughs> in my case, yes. There's a lot of channels and a lot of chat Discord servers going on around. Yeah. I know. Not, not, not if you keep it tidy. <laughs> a proceed. I stabbed him right. like real quick. Really <laughs> <laughs> so now, now you get the reference. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> With the 32 damage total. Guess I stabbed him real good. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so, uh,. So yeah, uh, we're out of initiative, so uh, Samat, if you want to go put your kids down, go for it. Put them to sleep. <laughs> and, uh, while the priest is away, I'm going to loot them. Loot uh, the guys? Yeah. yeah. Alright, um, roll for investigation. <laughs> this is gonna be bad. Oh my god! <laughs> Natural one. Natural one. Natural um, one. You uh, you go through the bodies and um, like those guys mustn't be very rich because you can't find anything on them. Can't even they find have, pockets. They have they have cl clothing and like sword. Uh, you can take their scarf if you want, but uh, that's all you find. Uh, how many scarf do they have? Two. 
Like one each? Well, I mean, they have one each, yeah. Mm. Nah. <laughs> nah. Nah. Uh, so I, I don't have them on the map, but uh, there's people in the jails. So uh, there's one uh, human girl. Uh, I'm going to try to break the break the door for the free the. There is two persons who work on one person. So there's there. there's two uh, teenager in this one, and there's one uh, girl, well, uh, an adult, older. Okay, I'm um, going to open woman. this one. You open it. Um, I you, have to. You're trying to just like. Burst it open with sheer sheer strength. Uh, I'm going to try like a. I I, I think that I have a. Uh, a lock. Oosh. So I'm going to try to that... bring, make the lock with my sword. I think. Uh, well, I mean, it's not like um. Like the lock is part of the door, so if you want to break the lock. You you need to break the door down. Oh, um, okay. So I'm going to call uh, Kate. Kate. <laughs> Kate, I need up? a favor. <laughs> Just you like, can uh, open the door, please. Yes, I can. And the woman is looking at you guys. Oh my God, you you killed them. You you guys saved us. Yeah. That's what we do, ma'am. <laughs> we kick ass and chew bubble gum. Uh, we chew pine oh. sap. And and you see like the, the, the teenagers seem to be like um just this not destroy but like their their mind is broken. Like they they don't really say anything. They're just looking in the void. Um Looking at the bodies on the ground, and yeah. Mm. Okay. Oh. So, why are you in there? Um, I, I, I think my, I, I, I'm not sure, but I'm pretty well. I'm pretty sure it's uh, my husband. He. He, he tried to stand up to the Red Bren, and the day after, they just stormed her house in the night. And now, they just, like, took us, and they brought me and our children here. Um, I haven't seen my husband since. Have you, have you guys seen him? What's his name? What does he look like? Yeah. His his name is uh, uh, what's his name? I don't know. You wouldn't know, lady. It's your husband, not mine. The lady is a little <laughs> confused. Um. Yeah, I'm a little confused. Um, so, uh, but your husband is here. And the teenager are your children. Yes. Yeah. The, the, they are my, my children, but, um, my, well, my husband is, uh, he's not very tall. He's an Omar guy, uh, fit and brown hair, uh, brown eyes. Um, have you guys seen anyone? So basically everyone. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, I, we haven't like, seen anyone since we got here, so. We haven't seen him yet. Okay, he mu he must be in he must be in the lair here. They brought all us all at the same time, so he, he must be somewhere. Okay. It's been okay. it's been maybe two days. Two days. Whoa. Two or three days that we've just been sitting in the cells and running away. And I haven't seen my husband since. I really hope he's okay. Well, we're going to look at 
for him but now we want to try to breed you and the girls yep we can free you but how, how can i put this um you won't be able to get out now there's no safe exit for you to get out did we stay here yeah it's it's better while we try to but, but you guys are going to come back right yeah definitely yeah they have some beast around here it's just crazy well, the, the beast is one of them that I'm referring to. We, we, we saw it, we went past it, but we kind of had a offering for safe passage, let, let's put it this way. But um, without the offering, well, we cannot guarantee that you're going to be able to get past, so. You Best we can do, we can free you, uh, just sit tight and we'll come back for you when it's safe to get out uh, okay um but but you you guys are strong right you're you're not you're, you're gonna come back you're you you guys are strong you're not gonna get killed by those bands right no we're not all right um well i mean there's nothing else we can do than wait it's just Thank you. Thank you very much. Well, uh, uh, I, maybe I suggest there's a room. If you go past the door here to your right, and then to your right again, there's a room full of weapons. So basically just barricade yourself in it, and we'll come back for you there when we're done. Can, can you guys show show us? Sure. Yeah, I'm sure. pretty Don't sure. The skeletons, they probably won't be coming back. The, the what? Yeah, did he did did he say skeletons? He kind of did. There were skeletons in the other room. Were like, well, I mean, skeletons are dead, so um, it's scary a bit, but it's not. Like they're it's dead. not un unusual, right? They kind of, uh... Yeah, no, they're dead. Definitely dead. Good. Uh, Alright. Now let's work on uh, getting you out. Cade? I'm gonna pick the lock. Go for it. Is it uh, what's what's your name, lady? <clears throat> I've got... it, it's a stealth check, or...? Uh, no, it's a dexterity check plus your uh, proficiency modifier. So plus seven, I think, because you have your uh, all, all your shit. Um, my my name is M Myrna. What? How? How do I call you guys? Uh, my name is Tamara. I'm Fern. I, I I don't know what to say. I like, uh, I sh I was sure we were gonna be sold like as slave or I don't know. I couldn't sleep just thinking about my children being enslaved to some weird fellow. Thank you guys. What is your husband's oh. name too? If we came come across people, uh, I'm gonna have to know. Maybe we have uh, we have to ask. Yeah, his name is uh is um. Hmm? Oh, okay. How do you write that? Car, Carl. 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 Okay. Pretty straightforward. <laughs> Carl. Okay. So, I got a natural one. <gasps> but since I'm lucky, I can roll again. True. So I got 17 yeah, plus 3 around. plus 7. 27. Plus, plus 3? My dex? No, uh, the plus 7 is the whole thing. Because it's... Uh, 24. Yeah, yeah. 
is 3 plus 2 multiplied by 2 for your other thing. So it's 4 plus 3, okay, so 7. That again. Yeah, 24. So yeah, you uh, effortlessly use your lock pick to pick the lock that is not that complex. It's a pretty rudimentary jail door. Um, so you'd have no problem with it. Um, yeah, so the, the first door open, uh, Mirna, uh, like just, like she, she's very weak at this point. She wants to like almost hug you guys, but, um, she's so weak that she has a hard time just walking because they weren't fed, fed all that much and didn't really do any exercise or anything. So uh, I'm going to help the the girl in this case to just uh, go out, and I'm going to take her to this room, like uh, like Fawn said. I'm gonna pick. The and uh, she she just told you, uh, I'm, I'm sorry, but uh, can I wait for my children? I don't want to get separated. Okay, as, yeah, you, no as you as uh, you arrive to uh, pass the door. Go for it. I got 10. Plus 7 or 10 is your final? 10 is my final. I got 3. <laughs> you um, you I'm fiddle get with... the weapons. While they're doing that, I'm going to get the weapons. Bring Which it to weapons? Me. Which weapons? Uh, uh, I, I said we're going to bring them up into the weapon room. Oh, sorry. All right. Uh, so yeah, you, you fiddle around. <laughs> uh, you fiddle with your tools and um, it takes a bit more time, but you uh, you do manage to like work out the mechanism uh, slowly and uh, find your, uh, your way into uh, picking the lock. So you open the other door. The children's are just um, crying at this point, and uh, they, you you help them up, uh, bring them to their mothers. They just like uh, her mothers just fall on the ground and hugs her children. Uh, it's uh, very like they are crying at this point, and uh, you guys just leave them some time to be together but um yeah you make your way right. you bring it bring let's, them let's to get you to make the... us feel emotions yes emotions i don't know I, i'm i'm just this i'm <laughs> just touched by the scene because i feel it. it's not no it's i got I nothing it in too. my eye it's uh, i'm just describing so what's well. happening <laughs> so yeah i'll uh i'll help them <laughs> to um to the room are they so yeah, do they look you're... just like in shock or they actually like wounded or they are not in shock they are just weak from not being fed and uh like uh, brought water uh in a good like way that would keep someone in the best shape they're not like some rations yeah, I have rations. Yeah, I thought about that too. And water. So yeah, the, the the children just jump on, like on it and start like hey, hey, eating kid. all of it. Um, hey, you learn to ask quick, politely. God, so yeah, I'm, I'm gonna give them uh, three rations. <laughs> all right. Um, Oh, those are not so bad. they they seem startled. Die, but you can raise them properly at least. <laughs> they they seem church or something. Man. And I'm just yelling at the woman. They would be. Just be... Oh. At this point, I... they're just crying. Like you make them cry <laughs> even more. Uh, they're they're scared of you just plainly scared of uh, this small guy just screaming at them. Um, but they still eat their ration. Uh, 
Uh, Myrna is uh, kind of giving half of our ration still to our children. Um, well, I gave them three rations, so they have one each. Yeah, but they're very hungry. Okay. So I give him all the... my rations. I don't care. We're in the village. <laughs> all right. So they are. They have plenty of food. They are in the room. Uh, as I'm you leave, the, I'm making. I'm making them say thank you. And I'm keeping most of the food. I'm giving them to the mother. All right. You Did go you to say... the shrine and you pray well for your kids, right? It's a deal, right? It's a shrine into town, you go and pray there. Yes, yes, of course. The, the shrine of luck, I think you guys are, are like best luck today. And uh, that we uh, ever had. Yeah. <laughs> of course, yes. Luck. Um. So you, you guys leave them there? Yeah, in the... Well, they have plenty of weapons. They have crossbows. Or pikes. Where are they? Yeah, they're I, I, they're I, in I, the I, prison? No, they're in the... Uh, the, 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 the store room. The, the weapon room, basically. We I just, I just take entrance. a crossbow and I give it to the... To the mm -hmm. woman. And then say, like, if you have to use it, use it don't um, doubt it i just give it to her all right um can can you can you show uh, is it loaded can you show oh, me it. what where um i've never used a, a weapon um, okay so i i just loaded the crossbow and i give it to her like here if you this is the the the, the, the trigger. trigger so if you're going to shut, you have to push that, and that's it. Please be careful and use it if it's necessary. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'll 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 do my best. Uh, at this point, I I just don't want to be captured again. Uh, thank you, thank you very much. Don't make any noise. <laughs> we we won't. Yeah. Um, we'll be and, back uh, for you as... later. As you as you leave, uh, she grabs your your hand, Fern, and she says, uh, "And if you if you see my husband, please, um, if you if you're able to to save him or at least um, find out what happened to him, uh, that would be very very nice." We'll, we'll, we're we're exactly going to do our best to get your, your car back, uh, miss. Uh, we'll do I'm, our best. I'm just taking one of these calls of the other room, and I'm like, is this your husband? <laughs> oh, no. Uh, I, I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. <laughs> <laughs> You're such a dick. <laughs> So, uh, right. where do we go now? We have two options. We go back the way we came. We make a safe path for the mom and the two kids, or know. we keep going, uh, keep going forward. I want to know what is in in this room. Yeah, let's go. And uh, if there is something, that we... so Same Tamara, side. you you go to the door and you open it to see inside. Yeah, a little bit just for C. All right. Well, I guess we're going forward then. I'm 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 gonna do the guidance on Tamara. So I'm, I'm gonna to touch watch her. her. I have to roll or no, or, or you just have one D four on your next ability check. Okay. So uh, as you open the door, what you see under. Other side is just a, a long corridor, and um, uh, there seems to be an opening at on the at uh, sorry on the south. It's open here. I uh, know. Yeah. Is it south possible here. to reveal the squares here? Uh, yeah. I'm not sure if it's a wall or. I guess it's just a wall. It, it is a wall. But I can still. God damn it! 
I should really learn like the shortcuts or if there is any uh, to switch between tools. But yeah, so as you open the door, what you see is a long corridor with uh, what seems to be an op opening at the end to the south. Okay, so... Maybe we should uh, try to find a trap. Yeah, exactly. So the opening is here, okay. but in the back it's a wall. Uh, yeah, sorry. All the back area is a wall, okay. So there's yep. just like a Everything door is... on the right. This is a wall. This is a wall. Okay. It's just a plain uh, corridor with uh, an opening, but the rest is all walls. Okay. Okay, you can look for tramps, please. I'm going to let you guys go ahead <laughs> since I'm not the stealthiest of us. I'll He's just turn back a bit. He, he know how to do so I guess I'm going to go slowly in the corridor looking for trap. All right. Make a... Uh... Make a perception check. Trap, trap. Got seven. Seven perception. <laughs> um, oh, you sure. looking out, you don't see anything that looks suspicious in the corridor itself. So there is something. How does it look, Cade? <laughs> it looked good. Hmm. For what I see from here. Okay, I'm going to advance just here to see you. Uh, All right. yeah. here. So, uh, making your way, uh, as soon as you step here, I the uh, the floor crumbles under your feet. Um, I make it. Dexterity check. Oh, I knew it. You, you got guidance. Uh, no, that's yeah. not an ability check. Sorry. You, you ain't got oh. nothing. Okay. A dexterity check? Uh, yeah, this dexterity saving throw. So, A saving throw? Oh, okay. Okay, okay. Which is a, this dexterity check. Ooh. 24. Nice. So you, uh, as soon as uh, the floor starts crumbling under your your feet, you uh, your very keen reflex, like you you're able to catch on the ledge and avoid falling down the pit. Okay, and I, it was just that piece of floor, so I can keep him walking. Uh, actually, actually, uh, it's more. How do I draw draw a shape? Or all so the curves fall down. It's the, the the whole area here. So like a ten feet ten feet uh, square that just collapses. Okay, and I and I stay here or here? I uh, I was able uh, to cross. In 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 the moment you're like uh as like it crum crumbles, you're able to catch either on uh to catch yourself either on like the ledge here or the ledge here, because okay. there oh, is yeah. a small, there is a small ledge on on the side. Uh, still. Okay. So, like, so the the. But we stay on. She she stays on this side. Here. Right. So yeah, I just go back and say like, did you see Kate? Did you see? It was a trap. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> it was it either a trap or it just very hold and it happened to be, but it really looks like a trap. So... Oh, Where's there the goes our way. Um, what, what did you say, Kate? Can we still cross? Make a, make a perception check. <laughs> Please. Fourteen. Yeah. So, um, like I said, you 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 notice there is still a ledge on each side of the the hole. You guys could manage uh, to try and um, 
walk the the ledge on on the side to get to the other side. Okay, so we how to... how deep is the the hole? Um, it's twenty feet. Twenty God feet. God damn! Okay, that's one hell of a pit. Yep. It isn't just crumbling for fun. It is a trap. It is a trap. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> So does everyone want to cross, or are we on the way back? Or we could find another way around it. I don't know. I've experienced a twenty-foot fall already in here. <laughs> uh, I could skip the next one and just. There's places we haven't been, so we could just go somewhere does else. Does it look safer? The ledge looks safe. Um, enough for us to walk yeah okay well, well i think it i think it would be okay if it's uh it's just that you know we could only, we could see it's just a few feet we could go and see if there's a there's a door or something why do i have an accent all of a sudden <laughs> And doing voices. Mm. So tricky. Yeah. Well, I'm going to try to cross. Uh, well, Art. before you try to cross, uh, let me do something. Uh, I'll take the rope and I'll tie it around her just in case. So, uh, what I think of is uh, we should do that for every single one of us. So, we tie wait, wait. each other to the rope. If one falls down, well, he's going to get caught by the yeah, rope. Well, and yeah. the other one, if he crosses, the other one is going to be safe. And, you know, basic right, climbing dude. things with rope. <laughs> you go first. If I fall, I don't think uh, your little uh, buddy will hold me long. <laughs> no offense. <laughs> so, Kate, you're going first, or uh, Tara is still first? Yeah, I'm going first. Alright. So, friend ties the rope ar around your waist, and uh, off you go. Make a necrobatic check. Okay. Oh! Oh! <laughs> okay. Where is my necrobatic? <laughs> okay. Oh shit! Okay. Eleven. Yeah. Um. You like. You are like slowly making your way, hugging the wall, doing small step. Like, at one point, everyone like holds their breath, and like one of your feet, like maybe like uh, just uh, slip the the ledge, but you're able to catch yourself and you make your way through uh, safely. You are on the other side. Uh, you're good. All right, Kate. Can you test the floor over there? I just. What? No, no, stay, stay wrapped up. Keep it around okay. you. You're the anchor on the other side. Okay, okay. <laughs> you're the anchor. That's why I'm saying, Kate. Kate, you're next. <laughs> and uh, I'm gonna tie up uh, Kate as well. With another rope or with the same rope? I have 50 feet of rope. I think I can do a couple knots. Uh... All right. With the same rope? Yeah. With the same rope, yeah. So acrobatic? Yes. A 12? You make it through. Same. Uh, as Tara slowly uh, making your way on the the ledge, hugging the wall, but you you safely make it on the other side. Okay. So, uh, one of you, well, probably Cade, throw your rope back to us, and uh, Semat, you're up. I'm going by weight. I'm trying to make it like even. As much weight as the one that crosses, there's enough weight to hold him down on the other side. Right? Yeah. 
Do I have to throw the rope? Mm -hmm. Make an acrobat. No. <laughs> I'm kidding. Is acrobat? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> yeah, no. You, you're able to just throw the rope. Uh, Tamara is and holding I it to it. Uh, so if you... <laughs> you so throw it. Even if you fail, like you, you're not gonna lose the rope. So very, yeah, because it's one you, rope. You're not that strong, so you need three attempts, but you finish uh, by landing the rope on the other side, burn, catch it. Samat, so you're up. Good. Tie up Samat, so and I uh, slowly uh, push him towards the the edge, just to make sure that he knows what we're doing. You can. Cover, you cover a number so, of feet up to your strength score. That's the jumping. Oh. You want to jump? You want to jump? Uh, uh, I don't know if I can. <laughs> wow. I'm gonna hold you the rope. You can certainly try. Yeah, why not? <laughs> I don't remember how it works for jumping. Athletics. Oh. You try to jump an unusually no. long distance, it's athletics. Yeah, but I can only jump uh, no, uh, 14 feet. Would I what? need to jump 15 to clear it? Because the what? chasm is 10 feet, right? Yeah. I mean, I got 14 strength, so technically I can jump 14 feet. Yeah, I'd say you're uh, you're able. Just the, the the hole is ten feet, so if you want I to try, it, want you can. To see this. Hey, no need for some hippity uh, bean flip flops. Look at this. Car, dwarf skin, jump. <laughs> Make a an acrobatic check. Not acrobatic, uh, athletic. 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 No, Aesthetic. No, I can jump 14 feet all the time. Oh. Oh. Okay. I thought you had to uh, make your roll still. And I will post the uh, if you if you want. So I, you... I will post the uh, <laughs> the long jump rule. <laughs> if that's how you want to do it. If I need to make a roll, <laughs> I don't know which. I will add better meeting athletic anyways, an acrobatic. Uh, yeah, no. Uh, I think it's fine. So yeah, you, you, you just see a friend flying by you guys, uh, jumping like a crazy <laughs> madman. You mean so mad? <laughs> I haven't jumped yet. Do it. But you don't actually make it all the way, like you just like end up <laughs> on the <laughs> ledge. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to act very cool, but then in the end, you don't make it exactly all the way. So you just have to grab yourself and... Uh, I'm, either... I'm grabbing Tamara and Kate at the same time. Just pull me back. I just pull. Did it all by myself. <laughs> so according to the long jump rule, I can jump up to 15 feet. You can make it. Are you going to do it? Yeah. Do I need to move my character on the I'm map? I'm going to move too. It doesn't really uh, matter. I know you guys are on the other really side. Matter. So, uh, yeah. Well, You're gonna jump? if a four feet tall dwarf can do it, I'm going to do it too. So it's just a ego at this point. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and I'm just so doing the ha ha. So it's the just like it's coming and <laughs> it's just the slow mo of the big guy with like radiating his i5. He <laughs> makes it way like all the way there, but like the sheer strength of his old body hitting you, you just roll ten feet in <laughs> uh in the back from the impact of the high five. <laughs> that's uh ah, Samad. That's what I call fun. <laughs> is there a door or something in there? Uh, no, it's just uh, it's just a, an entrance, like a 
a ledge. It, it, it's kind of uh, the the wall is broken. Um, it wasn't like um, in a door per se. It's just uh, uh, at the, at this place the wall is kind of crumbled, and uh, you see on the other side there's a, a room. Give me uh, two two minutes. My uh, oh shit encounter. My enemy is calling. All right. Shall we proceed? Proceed. Oh. Whether that creature is enemy or friends. Which chat are you talking of? Oh boy, Good. okay. okay. I thought no, we were I... using your World 20 as a chat, but I can do it in Tavern chat as well. Nobody is doing this. <laughs> like, sometimes I post stuff in the chat. I don't even know if you guys see it. Uh, which chat? Probably not. Roll twenty. No, I'm pretty sure I gave um, an inspiration point to Fern and Semat, and I just whispered it in row twenty because it was easier. Oh, oh yeah, from Kidio, right. take an inspiration now. point for that. <laughs> oh. What is that? I I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> what was it? Hold on, hold on. It was... I'll keep saying not... stupid shit. And Wait, I think August twenty seven. It was three weeks ago. I have I, inspiration since then. Whoa. I don't remember exactly what it was. Semat, it was probably um, <sighs> when you buried the dead or something like that. And burn. Okay. There's no I time stamp on the messages. No? Nope. Yes, I have right. some. Yeah. At 10.46 yeah, yeah. p.m. on exactly. August 27. I just have to go in the recordings and see what. Chat names down. Just kidding, Maybe. by the way. I'm not gonna go see. All right, let's proceed. Okay. Proceed. Yep. Um, My observation well, was: Can we go through the door? The the sorry yeah. the the hole is there? Yeah. yeah. Well, I mean, you you at at this point, if you make your way in front, you do, um, you do see through the hole. And uh, you see, you see just a couple of stairs. Okay, it, it's <clears throat> yeah. Uh... Looking, look, looking inside the um, this place, you you see uh, a door uh, on the east and a couple of staircases that goes from that door down uh on the like common area and you guys are up there do we hear anything coming from the room make your perception check perception am i perceptive thus i'm little perceptive I got 18, 17 plus one. Great. Um, you, you hear like faint water, uh, kind of pouring into more water. Well, you, you, you hear some water. Like, it's not a big noise. It's just, you, you hear just. Like, just a like a fountain of, in yeah, somewhere in the room. A, a, a small fountain. Okay. And that's pretty much all you can pick up. One of you want to so go gonna, first, uh, or gonna... I shall do the honor? Kid, okay, you want to scout ahead? Yeah, I can do. In a stealth. Oh, well, it's kind of your job. <laughs> Are you. Stealth check! <laughs> go for it. You don't have to scream it, man. <laughs> Sorry. Still check like a power ranger. <laughs> so good. <laughs> did you see the last movie of Power Ranger? It's fucking weird. <laughs> yeah, I did. Awesome. I'm not. Max is. Max yeah, I think he froze. <laughs> Yeah, he's, he's, just, he's, going to. he's just froze there. 
<laughs> I'm gonna have nightmares with that. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, wait, he's back. I lost two there. Uh... Yeah, yeah. Did I do? We... <laughs> Damn it. I we got, lost you. Uh, so stealth, dude, that we even <laughs> lost you. I got uh, 24. 16 plus 7. So yeah, uh, you feel pretty stealthy, you make your uh, way inside. Are you are you going to the door? Are you going down the stairs and looking to more of the, the room? Or what are you doing? I'm gonna go... Wait, I'm like there. I'm gonna go look more into the room. All right. So... Um, hmm. So what you see is a. Uh, so it, it's a large uh, cellar uh, with fifteen feet like ceiling heights. Um, the stone steps are descending uh, to the floor, and in two short flights of stairs that uh, you can see here. Um, there's. Um, You see a, a large stone uh, cistern occupies the western part of the room, whose walls are lined with kegs and barrels. So it looks something like... The fountain? Mm. Sorry? It, it looks like a fountain. Is it a fountain? Yes. It's a cistern. Oh. What's yeah. a cistern? Deeper. French. What is a cistern? Okay. Well, that's what it's written. It's probably the same as a cistern. The DM doesn't know what's in the room. It's bad. I told you it's a cistern. <laughs> I googled it. That's how it's pronounced. Yeah. It's a tank for storing water. I look for traps. It's a water tank. The room. But yeah. is is there like a, a tap or is it flowing from somewhere? Yep. Yeah, yeah there's okay. some um, some water pouring in. It's not a high like debit. Can I see debit? I know. It's it's not high um throughput. High flow. Yeah. Okay. Uh, but still, it's fresh water. Is it safe to come in, Cade? I look for a trap. Alright, make a perception check. Perception. So good at those. Got twenty one. Nice. You uh, make it through like an inspection of the room. Um, you don't see anything that seems harmful. You're pretty confident that in your uh, skill of like looking around and not, nothing seems out of place. Um, it's good. I'm gonna step in the room, but um. Right before I do, I'm just gonna like before I step in, I'll touch the floor just to make sure that it's steady because I don't trust now that the floors are good, even if Kate right. says so. So you're uh, kicking each floor tile as you make your way. Yep. Just make even sure. if people walk in front of you, because <laughs> you're very heavy, so the trap could trigger uh for just you <laughs> all right uh you don't find anything uh, uh even making your way like this everything seems fine okay what are you guys doing i'm going to check this door just to see if the, i can open the door the door doesn't seem to be locked. 
Um, I'm going. I'm going in the room with them. Okay. And I'm going I just to noticed fight. that some of my what I say is is not passing through. So I'm gonna just get near my near. And what? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <sighs> Never mind. <laughs> my noise gate is is blocking some of what I say. Alright. Um, I'm just gonna wait by the cistern. Alright. I'm, I'm going just to open a little bit and I'm going just to sneak uh, and see what is in there. Alright, make a perception check. Mm. Where's my perception? Okay, fourteen. Yeah, uh, sorry, I meant a stealth, stealth check. Oh. To see uh, if you're able to pick in without being noticed. Thirteen. Um, how much? Thirteen. 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 All right. So, um, and what was your perception check? Fourteen. All right. So, um. You look inside, um, and what you see is that this appears to be a storeroom uh, pressed into a service uh, as a living quarters. There's two uh, double bunk beds that stand against the wall near the door, and there's uh, barrels and crates that fills the rest of the room. And uh, you also see uh, three red brands. Uh, on the like two on the beds, the other one is just uh, uh, sitting on some crates, playing with like cards or whatever. They're just um, like it's their room, so they're going around with their life in their rooms. Okay, so I'm going to close the door just <laughs> uh, very silent, and I'm going to say like, guys, there is just three three persons there <laughs> the the red hat so we going to enter or uh... obviously Actually, let's cut the head of the snake and try to find that glass tap dude maybe and come back for them later okay I actually so make a perception check right now you're in the, the room right Sixteen. All right. Um, so you actually uh, like you're just walking back and forth a bit, looking around, and you um, you notice that there is a satchel on right next to um, the cistern. So uh, mm. give me a satchel. Two so okay. So you, you see that it's um, it's open, and well, I mean you, you can go and uh, investigate it, but at this point you see it's open, and as you notice the satchel, you also notice that uh, there's like water all around it, and some like fading footsteps that are uh, going uh, up the stairs. In, into the dirt mixed with the water. Um, but like yeah. around here? What's that? Like, the, like moving upstairs, but then at some point, like the water and the mix fades. Um, and like as whatever was walking, um, mm -hmm. like the, the water just sank into uh, the dirt and uh, just faded out. So someone enter from the cistern 
to that place? Did I? It, like, okay. Just give me a second. You can, you, you can go. I'm reading a spell. <laughs> what? You can go investigate the satchel, but uh, that's how you, all that you notice right now. Well, I heard footsteps. What? I heard what? footsteps, you said. No. You see. You see the footsteps. Oh, I see the footsteps. Because, like, you, you notice there's a satchel open, like, oh, and okay. it's wet and there's water around it. I'm going to say, then... look at this. Look at this. And uh, I'm following the footsteps. Hey, uh, well, Yelf, you, you're good at tracking, right? Come and, come and see this. Who's good at tracking? Well, we have a ranger. Technically, I would say the ranger. <laughs> what did you see? Um, I'm showing the footsteps. Okay. So I'm going to follow the footsteps. And in what point the footsteps disappear? About there. Oh, shit. Okay, so I'm going to uh, check where the four steps came, and I'm going to check the the satchel. Make an investigation check. Which which way are the footsteps going? It's going no, no. from the sat from the satchel to here. Okay. Uh, so like they make their way. Uh, it seems to be. Uh, like going from the satchel to the stairs, making their yeah, way I'll up. I'll be the going stairs. up here. So whoever was here came from he the came cistern the... and he went towards the other door we see at the end of the room, basically. So, I mean, it's worth checking out what's behind that room. So my investigation was at eight. Eight? Yeah. Um, well, the um, the the satchel is empty. So what you notice is that um, it is there's a rope tied to it, and the rope is um, attached to the bottom of the cistern, and the satchel is empty. I'm going to pull you... the rope. It's it's stuck. Okay. Uh, I'm, um, you, you can't. I'm you can't make. I'm looking at the door uh, in front of me. I, I was just gonna say uh, uh, to Tamara that she can make a yeah. strength check if okay. she wants. I'm going to wait. What is going to Semat do? All right. So is is the door locked? I'm trying to open. It's not locked. That is Kate, exit, right? I don't trust doors. You go ahead. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> I have too high of a wisdom to do anything else than that. So I'm Seriously? gonna... What are you doing? It's not, it's not luck. What do you see? I'm gonna peek. Peek inside the door? Yeah. Okay. I thought you were looking for traps, but go for it. Uh, Make a perception check. <laughs> I'm sipping back. <laughs> Got 16. You open, uh, so yeah, you open the door, you look uh, on the other side, and um, you get a, a draft of fresh air. And you look outside, and uh, there's light 
it's sunlight. It's dimming down at this point, like uh, it's maybe four or five in the afternoon at this point. Um, but yeah, it's the way out. Okay. It, it goes outside. Wrong way. Okay, so uh, I'm going to call uh, Fern. Fern, I need your help here. I need some string for pull this uh, rope. I'm coming. So, um, I'm going to try to yank off the rope with Tamara. On the count of three. Okay. Make a strength check. Or athletic check with advantage. Since Tamara is helping you. Okay. With advantage? Yes. Just for safe measures. I have uh, 20. Analytics. Right. Um... So you pull on the the, the rope, and um, like a, a tile of the floor of the um, of the cistern just comes out, and you pull it out. There's a hook on the tail uh, on the tile, and the rope is tied to it. So um, it, it, you you get the feeling that it was just to. Uh, uh, hold the satchel inside. I have a feeling that it was just to hold the satchel inside. Like, like a, a secret. Can I grab, can I take the satchel? You, you can, yeah. Yeah, you can uh, un, You can untie it. You can also make an investigation check. Can I make an investigation check? Yes. 20, 20, 20. Oh my god. Natural one. Uh, it's a satchel. Yay, <laughs> I got a satchel. Uh, we're going to take uh, that then after we're going to investigate it. <laughs> Maybe. Sorry? Uh, we're going to take the satchel and uh, maybe we can uh, get the to know what is in there after we finish this, maybe? Satchel is empty. There is nothing else there? Nope. I don't know. <laughs> it's not even an item. Okay. So the only way we have to go now is... Um... Obviously the proper, the, the owner of the satchel took what's in it and, and went away up the stairs. Yeah, he bailed with it. Yeah, for sure. Okay. Well, we have two choices. We we have we can go back and uh, kill the beast, or just uh, near there is three red hats, so we can enter and kill them. We we could question one of them. Okay. Uh, at this point, uh, the door opens, and Tamara, you just meet high with one of the red brand. That is uh, just coming out of his roof. <laughs> so they're coming out of there. Yes. Well, I mean, um, yeah, he's just coming out, and Tamara, you were there, and just as he his head picks outside the the, the door, just. Uh, over the the cistern, you just meet eyes with um, uh, with him. What the, what the what the fuck? Who who are you guys? Hey hey, come here come here! And uh, the other ones are uh, just gonna. Well, at this point, we're just gonna roll initiative. Okay. Mhm. Mm eight. What happened with the eights today? I have I 16. Ooh. 16. 
10. You don't even have to change it. You had 10 last time. <laughs> I re-rolled the same thing. Um, 13. 13. 13. 13. Right. 3 past 10. Uh, great. So, Cade, you're up. Fastest one. Uh, how can I move? Uh, you. Well, if you can jump down, but uh, you would take damage. Or if you go around, you have. Uh, I don't remember actually. I think you have either twenty five. Yes, yeah, twenty five. Twenty five. Yep, you can you can go there. Because he's a rogue. Because he's a halfling. And a halfling. Yeah. So um, I'm gonna shoot him with my crossbow. Because your range up there was not um, enough. It probably was enough. Okay. Uh, no, it's fine. Uh, you do, you do, you do, you go for it. I got eight. Eight uh, misses. So as you run down the stairs and like uh, take all all your breath to run, uh, you attempt to shoot the guys that. The, the guy that just came out of the door and um, you you can concentrate enough and just uh, shoot right next to him in the wall. Is that is that your turn? I guess that's it. All right. Next up is Fern. So that you're next after the guys. I am. Um, well, does that work? If I do that, then I go here. You, you can make jump. Oh, no, you can't. <laughs> you can't. Not without a running start. <laughs> but I still can make it with 30 feet. Maybe Up you there. can walk on water, on the water. Is it if it's not too deep? Is it deep? It is. It is uh, kind of deep. It's ten feet deep. Oh, Never shit. mind. I can. Well, I have enough movement. I think I have thirty. Wow, ten feet. But the question is, can I move um, diagonal like that? Do 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 do. Yeah. We'll say you can. So I'll get a new range. Uh... And I'll smack the guy. <clears throat> Warhammer style. Warhammer style. Go for it. Oh, we we'll have a 20, 16 plus 4. Uh, that hits. Where's my. No. Yes. I got nine points of damage. Smirk! Nice. <laughs> Is that it? Yes. That's pretty much all I can do since I picked weirdly and I have two weapon fighting but I have a shield can do much about so yep yeah, that's but two, I, I looked it up and two weapon fighting is anyone like everyone has it even Kate oh, it's just 
something it, like the basic bonus action that you can do is two weapon fighting. Because the only bonus action I have is two weapon fighting, and I have yeah. second win. That's all. But two weapon fighting is a bonus action that everyone has. Like in action, you can take dodge, you can take uh, like disengage, uh, you can take hide. Like yeah, there's a couple of built-in action that you can take and. Two weapon is a bonus action that everyone can do. Yeah, but I don't have two weapon. I just yeah, I know, but but it's not. Um, it's it's the same for everyone. That's what it's I'm not saying. Special. It's not special. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. It. It's not like you picked it. Mm. Yeah, you didn't pick it. It's just by default. So it's not something that you did wrong. It's just it's it's written there, but it's not to do it. Mm. But I don't really have a second uh, a bonus action I can do. Yeah, no, I don't Basically. think so. Yeah. But in my case, it's different because I have fighting style. Yes, you have and... second win. Okay. Yeah, I have second, second win, win, but that's basically action. that's just healing. Yeah. But it's not anything that is offensive. Oh, no. Well, your protection, so since you're a tank, it's not. Yep. That's it. All right. Um. Next up is the red brands. Um, <clears throat> so this one, like he, he just opens the door, he gets shot at. Uh, the guy just like runs around the cistern, just leaping on the corner to cut them uh, through, and gets in his face, warm uh, on the shoulder. Um, Smirk. And he's gonna reciprocate with. Uh, uh, with his uh, sword, with his sword. Sword, sword. That's uh, eighteen to hit. Eighteen hits. All right. That's five damage. I'll take it. And he's gonna hit again. That's twenty to hit. Uh, this time I'll use a reaction. I'm gonna cast shield, which All right. uh, which brings my AC to twenty three. So uh, you just like yells and uh, cast your spell, um, and the second second blow just is like pushed back by uh, energy field. Um, at and... this point. Yep. Yes. That lasts until the start of my next turn. Yeah. All right. So you have plus 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 five bonus AC for until the the end of your turn. Of until the start of your next turn. Okay. Good. Um. And he's going to stay there, but he's going to yell, Hey, there's a guy shooting! Come help me! And uh, the others going to... How many movements do they have? Um, The other one is going to come here, trying to get to the small one, but um, he's going to attack you with advantage because he's flanking you. Mm -hmm. That's 20, so it misses again. Misses. So you're just uh, standing your ground with the aura against you, he's just hitting Gonna try again. This time, twenty-two, which misses. It's just ding, ding. The the sword reflecting from your aura, um, and there's the other one that is gonna come here, and um, 
attack you again because it's the only one mm -hmm. he can reach. And it's nine to no, it. No, denied. <laughs> again. And this time 24. Oh, 24 hits. Damn, son. Uh, and this is a five point of damage. So they are just like... <clears throat> It's just a, a, a scene that you see the guy is just there and the other ones are just ding, ding, ding. More, uh, just giving all they, they got on it and you're just standing there taking most of the hit uh, one go through when your uh, spell starts fading down. Uh, but uh, that's it. That's yep. their turn. And Semat, it's uh, your next... I'm gonna cast Bless. On? What's the range on Bless? Is it three? 30 feet. Fine. Can I, I can target everyone. I don't think you can target uh, Fern. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, okay. I know my grid. I know my grid. So, bless up to three creatures of your choice. So, it's going to be. Um, Are you a heavy hitter, uh, Fern? Sure. I say so. Yeah, so, um... <laughs> Don't know. What yeah. is a heavy hitter? So, uh, uh, these three. My three... My three friends. Oh. <clears throat> you you get 1d4 uh, bonus to any, uh, uh, well, all attack roll or saving throw. Nice. Okay. It's not going to go well for them. I surely hope so. <laughs> Is that your turn? Are you moving or? Mm -hmm. Um, all, uh, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, I, I, I think I'll stay here, I, I'm fine. You feel I safe? Here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, I feel tall, you know, <laughs> for once as a dwarf, so I can oversee everyone and I'm close to the door. <laughs> if anything happens. <laughs> Sounds good. Um, Tamara, you're up. Okay. And so Cade, you're next. I'm going to move here. And I'm going to hit the, with the sword. Uh, 15. And 15 hits. Okay, and <clears throat> that guy have damage? Nope. Oh, okay. Too bad. <laughs> Not yet. Ooh. Nine. Nine, Nine points, of points of damage. That's slashing, right? Oh, uh, yeah. Piercing damage. A short sword is piercing. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Slashing. It says the match tag piercing. Piercing. Piercing short sword. Yep. Yep. Okay. Hmm. Um. And like with the, I'm going to hit with the, my bonus action. Ooh, twenty. Twenty to hit. With the d4? 
What? Because you're blessed. But anyway, it still hits. Oh, but... I don't know that. I, I don't remember. Okay, 20. <laughs> Without the, that. Yeah, that hits. And another... Another 9 of, of piercing damage. And you added your d8 to that? Oh, yeah. No, I didn't. Because this, this, this time he, he took damage because you hit him. Good. Eight. So... Eight total? No. Uh, nine plus eight. Wow. So 17? Yeah. That's crazy. How do you want to do it? Hey. Boom! I'm going to just take the two swords and I'm going to crush it. I'm going to stab him really so just... good. <laughs> yeah. Twice. Yes. So he... So Fern, as you just get surrounded, uh, the guy that... Like, one of the guys just marching on, on you, uh, you just see the sword, like, peeking through his skull and through his mouth, and he just falls down to the ground. And you see Tamara on the other side, uh, oh. bloody sword <laughs> and rage inside her eyes <laughs> and that's it uh, are you moving are you staying where you are i'm going to stay in there all right Cade, yes. you're up i'm gonna move there and shoot this one all right move for it Oh. Is he tall enough to see above the cistern? Yeah. Ah, yeah. Like this, it's 10 feet deep <laughs> into the ground, but um, the rim is two feet high. Okay. I don't know how how high uh, how tall? it is. I don't know. How tall? But it's probably more than two feet. Wait. Oh, oh. we just lost you. Samantha is gone in the street. The stream is. So we are blessed. Is it plus four on the head? Yep. A, a d4. You roll a d4, I think. You can wait for Semat to confirm, but I'm pretty sure blessed. It's, is... it's you roll a d4. What happened? <laughs> Everything fresh. He clicked the big red button. Yep. The bless is a D4, right? Yep. For everything? For, For attack, attack rolls. rolls. And saving rolls. Oh, not on the hit? Yeah. Yeah, attacks, yeah. That's, that's yeah, your attack, attack roll. is your hit. So okay. plus one D4 to a hit or for a saving troll. And for saving troll. Everything. Okay, so I got 12. Mm -hmm. 12 with the d4? Yeah. So, um, the guy, like, the guy you just uh, tried to shoot, um, so he's watching you, and as you make your way around the cistern and try to shoot him again, uh, he ducks out of the way and you misses. You miss. Okay. So the cistern is not tall enough for me to hide behind. Um, no, but you you could like uh, get into like some barrels or there's crate and stuff that uh, if you get to you could find a way to to hide. Jump in the water. <laughs> Where you you were here, right? Or in the oh, stairs? I was on the stair. So is it enough for you to? If we go five, sideways, ten, good. fifteen, yeah, yeah, you can w make your way there and uh, use your bonus action to try and hide. I'm gonna hide. I got thirteen. All right. So 
that's it. Good. Uh, next is phone. Yeah. So my uh, super duper shield aura fades. As I start my turn. Um, Probably saved your life. No. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, I'll do, I'll do, I'll do, I'll do, 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 do. Okay. Uh, wait. Bonus action. I'm going to do second wind. All right. So 1d10. Which one is d10? That's a 12. The one with 10. Nice. Um, and none above. Uh, so, wow. That was worth it. I regen uh, 5 HP. Well, it's half of, like, it's the average of what you get with a D10. Yeah, but it's 1 D10 plus 3 HP. So, okay. no, it was a 2. <laughs> so, the 2. Um, right. hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, I have to update that. Um, so, and then I'm going to take my shield because I have just thought about that. Take my shield with a war hammer. I do a little uh, sigil on it, bang it, and I'm going to cast... Blade Ward? Yeah, it's Blade Ward. On myself. How many spells do I do here? That's a cantrip. Blade no. Ward is a cantrip. Uh, shield, I have two, uh, two spell slots. Shield is a reaction that takes a spell slot. Okay. <clears throat> so that's the one that uh, cuts out uh, cursing and slashing and bludgeoning damage? Blade Ward, yeah. yeah. It's a cantrip. But it kind of takes my action, so. Yeah. And uh, ba -ba -ba, let's go all out. Action surge. Ooh, nice. And I'll bash the same guy I was bashing before. All right, roll for attack. With bless. Yeah, yeah. Oh, with bless. Let's just hope I hit something. Ooh! A 24. The hits. Roll uh, the damage. Uh, do damage. Uh, I need to take, take my dice out more often. Which one is eight? Five points of damage! Yoink! Nice. He, so you um, you hit him again, like after. Um, where did this guy take damage? You hit him yep. just once, right? Yep. Yeah. Uh, so he, you hit him like exactly in the same spot, and uh, he, he's looking very rough. Like uh, he gets to his knees, but he he gets back, but. Um, not going well for him. Is okay. that your turn? That's my turn. All right. So it's uh, the ruffian's turn. So um, so they don't see any uh, other opportunity than just try and like make their way through you guys. So. Um, so the, the first guy is going to try and attack you again. That's 18 to hit. Mm, yep, it hits. That's, um, six Ooh. points of damage. Uh, he's gonna try again. Nineteen. 
Uh, okay, on this one, I'll react. Can I react? You can. React, it's use... A new, a new turn. Shield! <laughs> AC boosted to 23. What was the attack roll? I, I don't know. Yeah, you had 19? Yeah, okay. So it misses. Yeah, you... And that's your last spell slot, right? Yep. Alright. Um, so yeah, he, he, he slash... Uh, right, like, right after you hit him with your war armor and he kind of uh, stumbled back up, he just picked you, you in, uh, like, the side of your uh, stomach. And... Um, just when you notice that you cast shield and he, he attempts to attack you again, but then it gets reflected by your aura. And uh, the other guy is going to try and make his way. He's just trying to pass by you guys and uh, get out, seeing uh, Tamara cut his friend down and his other friends being hacked or uh, armored to death. Slowly, uh, he's gonna try and attack you, Tamara. So that's eight to hit. Eight? That doesn't that misses. Hit. He's gonna yeah. try them. Nine. Nine? Nine. Nine. Doesn't hit. So he, 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 like at this point, he looks uh, a bit, uh, not confused, but uh, like he, he he's starting to be stressed and uh, he's like, scared in his uh, shorts. Un- yeah, he's scared, unfocused. He attempts to um, to to slash you twice, but you are very grounded. You just killed one guy. It's going well on your side. You just whoop, whoop, es- uh, estimate uh, or uh, dodge both of the attacks. Um, and that ends their turn. It's going to be Sam up. Sam up still there? Uh, yeah, I'm still there. So I'm doing, uh, I'll, I'll do. <laughs> As much I, I can't do, that's very useful. So I'm going to do Toll the Dead on the one who was hit. Most. Who's can the you re- most? It's this one, but can you reach it? Um, What's the range on no, the day? Not where I am. Oops. Not where I am. It's 35 feet away. The range of so on told the day is. So one, two, three, four. And I'll get in there. Yep. So, uh, right. wisdom saving through. It is eight. The water starts to go dark, and what you could hear the sounds of bells bring back spirits of the dead that trying to stab him for six necrotic damage. How do you want to do this? Um, so, so what looks like uh, humanoid vapors, like if the dead was coming back to life in a translucent dark form, are basically rising up to his level and stabbing him right through him and, it, and piercing his really? heart and just it all goes pshash. Like a dark sand, and the water comes back. Nice. The guys fall down. Is that your turn? I'm going to hide back. <laughs> In your corner. <laughs> you're Tamara, you're up. Yeah. So, uh, what is the, the other guy? Uh, right there. in front of you. Oh, he moved. Ah, right in front of me. Oh, okay, okay, okay. He boozed. <laughs> he boozed. <laughs> <laughs> oh. uh, 
<laughs> okay, so I'm going to attack her. Uh, I'm, I'm, uh, I have bless. Um, yeah. Yes. Uh, how long? How long does be bless last? A minute. Not forever. I'm glad you asked. It's uh, one minute. So the, oh. the duration of the encounter. Right. Or the duration. It's concentration, of though, so I have to not get hit. Okay. So I can use the the D four, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. Yes. Okay. Eleven. Eleven with the D four. Yeah. Eleven doesn't hit. Yeah. Mm. So I'm going to shame. attack with then another sword. <laughs> Ooh. Twenty-two with the D four. Nice. Twenty-two hits. Roll for damage. 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 Critical damage. He has no. Uh, this guy doesn't, so you don't add your D8. Uh, so bad. She has advantage, though. Why? Oh, yeah, true. She's flanking. You have flanking. advantage. So technically, that would be your first strike at 22. Okay. Fine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> so, 8 points of piercing damage. All right. And then you get a second strike. Second strike uh, of your first attack. So that's my first attack. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Because yes. you you have advantage. You rolled twice. Your second was twenty two. Now you're okay. getting your second attack. So I'm going to I'm going for the second. And the second I have the advantage too. Yep. Yes. Yes. Yep. One. Two. With the D four. Nineteen. That hits. And now you yeah. add your D8. Exactly. <laughs> okay. Uh, now that's eight. a lot of damage. 12 points of piercing damage. I'm the to do this. Yay. So. <laughs> Why are we suddenly really, really kicking ass? <laughs> what happens? Uh, we so uh, we got left. level 11 and 3. <laughs> So I'm going to just stab him and then Real. throw it to the water. Nice. Ooh. So you just like uh, stab both sword and raise him, just throw him in uh, the water. So there's a dead body slowly floating in the water. The water slowly turning crimson. Crimson? Crimson. crimson. And yeah, now crimson. I just... Just get it there, the because that water was a uh, was, was drinking good. water. That's good water. Yep, so. good water. Yeah. It Sorry. was. Because yeah, I think there's one guy who escaped and might be the leader. Oh great! Now I'll have to get him out of the water to for proper funerals. God fucking <laughs> damn it! Oh, I remember that. So yeah, I bless you with all my might, and you you tank me with. I'm, sorry. Ah, I'm trying I'm to sorry. get. Uh, I'll, I'll drag. Out uh, I'll drag the buddy out. <laughs> Aren't we supposed to keep Thanks, one alive? Yo. Yes. He he's a real friend. We were supposed sorry. to keep one alive. Oh, we yes, got all sure. excited. <laughs> so yeah. <Yep>. <laughs> um. So now we go into the to the room. I know. What are you guys doing? Um, well, as as I remember, there were three three of them that you saw before. So the other room should be fine for us to go. And honestly, I need I need I need to rest a little bit, or somebody I... needs to touch me, but. I, I I touch a oh. fern and I cast cure wounds. Ooh. I like when when you touch me. 
Touch me. Touch me. Touch, touch me. On the touchy. I want to feel your body. <laughs> so that's uh, the eight. I want to get physical. six points. Yeah, yeah. Heal six points of damage. I, I will um, in, uh, investigation. Who is best in the advocate? Um, I, uh, thanks for the heals. <laughs> You're welcome. Investigation. Anybody with intellect. So possibly no, not not, not one of us. Not, uh, <laughs> yeah, I think it's not. Uh, not I really think a, the best <laughs> one would be Cade. Cade. You got nimble hands. Cade. <laughs> Yeah, I sure can try. Yeah, I give you my blessing to look at those corpses. You don't loot them. You just look for information. All right. Well, while well, they are yeah. they are doing that, I'm going to enter to the next room. I'm gonna follow okay. Tamara too. So all right, they're already gone. The body. Sorry, go ahead, Max. I got a natural one. You're as you're good lovely. as me. Okay. Well, it's it's your t t second or twice. It's her like second, year? just just tonight. But you have lucky, yeah. no? Yeah. Okay. Right, we're just saying that. Uh, oh, I was really there. lucky to have Five. lucky. Got six. You... Six. Yeah. For investigation. Um. Well, I mean, uh, you go through the pockets and like there's some uh, some silver, some gold pieces. Uh, you even find uh, one garnet, so a small gem, um, but nothing really uh, like paperish or um, information kind. Are are you are you keeping that or are you leaving it on it? I'm gonna keep it. Do you I, want can't, to... I can't do that. Do you, oh, I'm gonna you, leave it. You can try and uh, do a slate of and <laughs> check no, so, I'm gonna let so it that there. he doesn't uh, see it. Oh, that's okay. And you feel a, a hand on your shoulder, <laughs> <laughs> like a dwarf with the small eyes peeking at you like an eagle. And thank you, kid. <laughs> He's You're a good kid. And he's just breathing in your ears <laughs> <laughs> while you're while you're like going through the body. Just feel the presence always. <laughs> All right. With the skull, with you know the dark vapor coming out of the little skull. What's in the next room, Master DM? Uh, so we're we're scrounging, we're we're uh, investigating the their room, right? Is that it? Yeah. I wanna I, I wanna uh, do an investigation for see right. what it's if we, we can uh, find. Go help with the the elf. Okay. I know the elf is not very intelligent, so she might not know where to look. All right. So um, do investigation yeah. with uh, with advantage. Question. Cade so is uh, helping you. Okay, so. 17. I'll I'll try to lie in one of the beds for hopefully having a short rest. Hopefully, it, but I'll it's try. It's an hour short rest. Huh? Yeah, no, that's why I'm saying it I'll is. try. And and you have like kids and a, uh, a woman waiting for you guys. <laughs> yeah. Just want to uh, point that <laughs> out. Gonna take a nap there, man. <laughs> if I take a short wait, it's an hour. It's, they're fine. Yeah, well, you, don't, the... you don't know what's remaining in that underground. No. But yeah, you you can if, if you guys all agree, you can take a short wait. Okay, I have a well, twenty uh, he's, of he's, investigation. He's... While they were investigating, he's just laying down. But if we need to go, I think that's what he means. Yeah, like, that's what that precisely. While they I do see. their thing, investigating and everything, if there's enough time, 
for me to have a short rest, I will. Okay. Otherwise, I'm just going to have like a power nap, which doesn't count, but still. Mm -hmm. Great. Sounds good. Um, so, yeah, uh, so Tamara, with your investigation, um, you go through their stuff. It's it's really just living quarters. So, a bed, you find, uh, you find some red scarf lay, lying around, uh, like on the beds or, uh, uh, tied to not tied but hanged on the walls um going through this the crates it's kind of supplies uh they seem old like most of it is like rotten grain or um old apples and stuff that isn't really valuable you do find one uh one gem so one garnet uh in like the um like moving around the beds uh checking inside like under the pillows and stuff like that uh but apart from that nothing else of real interest did you say a gem yeah it's a garnet a garnet okay okay so i'm going to keep it um and I'm going to uh, take a, one of the red bands. Maybe, okay. I don't know. I'm going to take it. One of the scarf. Exactly. Slash hood. All right. Are you guys doing anything else? Um, Samat, how long would do your ritual take it's not very long it's just a small pair for each like uh like they hang hell mary or something like you know just a small prayer for each just to guide them okay in their afterlife and uh you know it's not there's no burial there's nothing it's just that i'm there and uh, that's it okay just that by the time they're finished i'm gonna be finished so it's up to you guys. Uh, are you doing it, anything else? Are you waiting for Fern or? Is everybody uh, all right? Anyone need a, a medical attention or a bit of encouragement? Fern needs some attention. What did you do, Fern, with with your um your health? You changed the uh. It's not 18 out of 18 for your HP. And you put something for stealth and zero to like you messed up all your stats. You messed up all the stats? I didn't touch it. <laughs> I'm just I'm just following the, 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 the what it says, but your mom messed up your stats. There, there. Oops, wrong one. All right, let's go back. Yes. Is All right, we, let's we... clear this place up. When you want is your AC? Or... No, no, 21 is not my AC, it's 18. There, you want 18. Sorry, uh, yeah, what are you guys doing? We we can go and take the girls and get out, uh, get put out the girls for this door. And if we going to continue, uh, so you want to go get the searching or the, 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 the mom and the two teenagers, you want to get them out through the door, but they have to go. Also through uh, a pit, a 20 feet deep, 10 feet wide pit. I mean, it's oh, not the, the safest way they can get out. Okay, this door uh, goes to the pit? What door? Oh, there. This door. That, no, that door leads outside? Oh, okay, I remember. But they have to go through uh, the pit. 
almost forget that. Okay, so never mind. Can I look around the room at the walls? See if I can find something suspicious. Yeah, make a perception check. I got 20. Natural 20 or 20 total? 18. Mm. Plus 2. Alright. So, yeah, you do know something. Uh, like, with all your experience, you already found, like, three secret door mm. or four in this dungeon. So, you notice a similar pattern right here. So you just so... Uh, put your hand on it, push it, it 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 pushes uh, like the other ones opens. Can I check? Yeah. I beat. Um, you don't have to do a perception check. It's just uh, it's just a corridor. Uh. Hey guys, I found another way. Okay, but still we have to go for the for the girls, sit down with them. There's a creature there. <laughs> so we have to kill the creature. Um if we want all three to get out, yeah probably we have to clear the creature before. Otherwise, so let's take some fruit from here and uh, feed the creature, bring back the people from here, and uh, let's go. Okay. Why do I hear feedback? Um, ba. 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 Okay. Ah. We're fine. Oh. <laughs> it was just a one-time deal, it seems. All right, so, so you guys take some rotten shit in the barrels and you you make your way through the secret door. Well, what looks tastier for a demon beast to feed on? And um, yep, I'm going to go get the beast. I'm going to go talk to the beast. Feel like uh, confident. Yeah. I'm gonna just go. <laughs> go. <laughs> All right. With food, like plenty of food in my hands, just like casually. I, do I need to move my character or something? Uh, no. Uh, well, yeah, you can put it in in the the room. Uh, you make your way in the room. You can make a perception check. Nineteen. So yeah, you uh, you do uh, notice the beast. It's uh, didn't move much. It's like hidden behind uh, one of the column. You can uh, spot like uh, its edge, like the back, his back, just peeking out the column. He's sitting maybe hey, behind. Hey, we're him. back. Here's this. here's some food, and I'm dropping like everything, kind of here. Okay. Um. So you 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 hear a voice filling your your head. <laughs> I don't just smell it from here. It's not black. What do you want me to do with? Grins and animals, and when we want flesh, you made Glastaff leave. He told me to kill anyone. Now I won't have flesh anymore. And here comes. <laughs> I propose. I propose we bring. Uh, one of the guys we kill <laughs> and give it to them. That's a gonna be. I just say it. Well, I'm hearing but it. I, I, everyone is hearing it. 
And, uh... Well, I mean, are you guys all making your way to the room, or uh, only Semad is there? I think only Semad is there. Because we are, because we are so, reading. Yeah. So uh, only Semad is hearing so, the conversation right now. Okay. So. Are, are you replying back or? Yep. Why would you help him if he's not helping you anymore? You can kill pretty much anyone you want now, and there's pretty tasty meat all around this place. Just let us go and uh, have fun, man. Where is the meat? And uh, well, you, you uh, can I explained it to him that he can go over here and just plan me a meat. <laughs> make a. Make a. I don't know if it's deception or perception at that point. <laughs> uh, I would say persuasion because it's not uh, a lie. Yeah. Yeah. Make a persuasion check. All right. 17. Well, if you kill them for me, then it could be an interesting bargain. But at this point, it would be easier to just kill you since you're. No, I don't think so, man. I'm a cleric. I could get. I could scare the shit out of you. I'm telling you. There's some friends over there, three skeletons. <laughs> They run like hell. They, if they could have, they could have put dead pants. You know what I mean? So let me kill them. Let us go kill them. We'll then bring them to you and uh, you can feed on them. That sounds great. Awesome. We'll be right back. Come on, guys. Hurry up. Okay. So we're going so to enter. We're going so to... what? What are? Where are you guys going? You're going back to uh, like the um, yeah, the, the passage the... where are you is here. This, is this bridge solid? Uh, if we test it, you can test it. I test it. It looks fine. <laughs> the bridge is red. That bridge is okay. Well, I mean, it's not. Uh, it wouldn't pass safety like uh, inspection, but it's functional. It's safe enough to go. Okay, okay. Yeah. Uh, so, uh, just wait a second, uh, Mr. Demon. I'm going to go back here, get the woman and child children. And then since I know the beast is kind of not, it, it's since the new beast is kind of on the safe side. I will bring him back to the escape route. And by the way, uh, Glassstaff is gone. We made him run away. Uh, Footprints was Glassstaff, I guess. So, yeah. So, do I have the time to go get the woman and child? And... Um, I mean, if you if you guys split up and. Uh, the rest of the group looks like they are gonna go and uh, do the deed. Uh, you would have time to uh, just um, not look like you're going in the same place. And if you guys wanna wait until I'm I'm back uh, before you know getting into this uh, baston, uh, would be safe. We we can start a fight for uh, the guys don't notice that you are uh, uh, liberated the girls. But... Yeah, you do know if we start a fight right now, we're going to be at a disadvantage because we're missing someone. So I just think we should basically Wait. just look out here where I am here. Just to make sure that uh, Semat has safe passage with the the lady and the two kids. So just just to know you, the, 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 the demon monster, don't know the guardian of the 
the shithole doesn't change so, his mind. All right. Okay. So you keep an eye on on the monster. Yep. Yep. Well, I keep an eye, but I like far enough that I can see Semat's movement and see the demon, but. Right. Well, I'm saying demon, I don't even know the thing. Yeah. The um, one eyed beast. So, Samat, you're making your way? Yep. So, you're making your way up, uh, taking the secret door and going back to the armor? That's right. Yep. All right. To make your way back. Um, Come on out, guys. It's safe. And as you open the door, you get shot by a crossbow. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, yeah. You, you open the door and like they, they kind of get uh, startled, but um, she doesn't know how to use the crossbow, so uh, nothing happened. But she says, "Oh, oh, uh, oh, yeah, you're back." Um, yeah, it, it's on. just. It's just you. It's not uh, the other ones. Um, Shut up! Come on. <laughs> so she she gathers her children, take them by uh, firm hand, and you make your way uh, down. So I give him an indication to go to to take the second bridge. Go to the ledge. Take the second bridge. You don't go with them. You're just giving them instructions? I'll go with them. I'll go with them. I'll go with them. <laughs> Alright. And so... I'm going to be between them and the beast. Right. And I'm going to say, I'm just leading some friends. They're not to eat. Everyone, I know you're hungry. But these are not the ones you should feed on. They're going to be the next ones. Make a deception check. A deception? Uh, I'm not lying. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Okay. Per persuasion. Either way, uh, ten. And yeah. I'm I'm looking at the beast very very carefully. Can I prepare a spell? I'm going at to prepare point, to prepare an action. Uh, old, uh, you mean old is spell if something mm. happens? Uh, what yeah. do you want to old and for what trigger? Arcane abjuration. It's okay. uh, you present your holy symbol at one celestial, elemental, fate, or fiend that can see and hear you within 30 feet. Uh, and it's basically turn undead, but for you know, demons. <laughs> I don't even if know what. Uh, Thing is. If it's a yeah. fae or fiend or a lamental. Um, it's an aberration. Oh, then it wouldn't work. Well, I mean, you, you wouldn't know. Wouldn't you wouldn't know. know. Nope. So you hold your skull for what? For like, if he makes any movement to you guys, or uh, I'm I'm going to prepare my crossbow yeah. if uh, the thing tries to just get to the gears or something. It's just I'm going to shut. Okay, so you just uh, I'm keep, following them basically. Keep the monster inside. Uh, at this at this point, the monster like doesn't seem to. Um, like look at you or pay much attention. Uh, it's just waiting. Uh, so you guys, uh, as you you make your way about here, and you hear a scream. <laughs> um, and you look at uh, Mirna, and she's pointing down uh, the crevasse at the body that was there that the Nordic. Uh, like eat um, or feasted on, and she just came. Why oh, was this? Oh, uh, my uh, God! I'll, I'll 
him back. To, I'll give. I'll give him back to you. Please, go move forward. Please, it's not secure yet. So at at that like at that point you very like you really struggle because like she's almost like trying to past you and you're not that big. Um, so you're just trying to to push them, but the nodic the the the, the monster the monster will, starts. Um, I will like, cast calm emotion on her. Okay, is it a save or anything or? Yeah, it's a charisma saving throw if she's if she is unwilling. Um, let's say it just works. <laughs> so yeah, it's a second uh, level spell. Thank you for not being. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, it, it, yeah, this is sacrifice for role play, motherfucker. <laughs> so uh, like she she was fran like frantic and just trying to get past you and almost like jump into the the pit, but uh, she just calms down arms like uh next to her body and uh she they, there's back. gonna be uh i'm gonna i'm gonna to say uh like to yell at the body and say why don't you give her a little help and uh through the little skull there's gonna be like a vapor a dark vapor but transforming into a white light of what seems to be a, a the silhouette of what might be her husband that's hugging her. That's that's the spell that you just cast to yeah. to make it uh, to calm okay. her. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. All right. So it seems uh, like she's whispering something in her ear. All right. So yeah, she 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 calms down. She uh, lose focus on on the body. Uh, keep focus on um, the apparition that you make walk in front of you um, and she follows uh, and her children also follows uh, looking back over their shoulder taking a peek on, on the body um, but still following their alive mother um, and uh, the note like uh, he, he's looking at you guys now but uh, he, he doesn't seem to be making a move and yeah you're able to uh, bring them over the, the bridge and out uh out of the cave all right so i'm gonna go join back with my friends so you just well, leave them something in the entrance no no i'm uh, I just i'm going out with them and go you're free now go home all right. You know what, uh, at uh, the uh, <laughs> the miners, what was her name? Oh, uh, which one? The miners exchange? Hell yeah! Go, go see end? hell yeah! Hell yeah! <laughs> All right. They nod. Are they going? Are they? Yeah. Are they going? Yeah. There. Don't oh. ever stop running until you're there. No, I'm going to shoot you. <laughs> what? <laughs> wow. Are they going? Yeah. Awesome. Okay. Don't ever sleep alone. Oh, wait. Okay. Where was the... Uh, what was Seldor? Is it, was he at the... Hell yeah, or was he at the inn? He was at the town no. hall, Seldor. Yeah. In the town hall? Um, master. No, oh. he, he he was he, he was with the guy who who went with with us here. The, where Peter! are they? I can't well, they, I think they gave so the, they get back. You, you don't really know like where they are at this moment, uh, okay, but they're so back. Yeah. They're I'm streaming hell yeah. Hell yeah. All right, and I'm going back. You're making your way back. Um, yeah, not moving towards the beast, but the opposite end. And uh, while this was happening and uh, Samat was uh, outside, uh, Tamara, I'll ask you to make a deception check. Me? Yeah. Oh, 
well. Okay. Uh, natural 20. Nice. Well, nothing happens. You don't notice anything either. Okay. Alright. Uh, so you guys are just uh, moving downstairs. Let's, uh, who's Let, going first? Let's go clear what's left of this uh, rat's nest. And I'm going downstairs. Boop, 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 boop. On the count of three. One. Two. Three. I open the door and I just do. What's up? So everyone bars in? Or just you? I'm going to enter too. I'll follow too. So everyone bars in? I'll, uh, I'll be more careful and I'll follow, uh, like I'll be here and I'm going to listen. All right. So as you enter, you see, uh, can you went on top of, <laughs> um, but you, you can make your way in, um, like, well, it's if, if it's a surprise yeah. round, technically, yeah, we got one, one whole round, right? Yeah. Um, well, I mean, you, you don't get that far, uh, but you, you're going to be able to move. We're just going to roll an uh, initiative soon, but... Uh, I'll... Kevin, if it's a surprise round, it means we have a, a whole round before they can start moving. Yeah, I know. But, okay. uh, but is that I'll, a surprise I'll... round? It, it, it's going to be, but I'm still okay. going to make you roll initiative, and then you can take your, your first turn. Still to see who's going first, and then next turn they are gonna have their turn. Um, so you see, as soon as you enter, um, there's several uh, worn tables and chairs that are scattered around this large room. Uh, wooden benches are drawn up against walls decorated with draperies and brown and red and several L kegs are propped up and taped. Four tough-looking human warriors wearing scarlet cloaks are gathered around one of the tables. A stack of coins and trinket is heaped upon the tabletop between them. So, uh, they, they seem to be like playing a game, uh, betting, uh, or gambling, and there's, uh, Ale being drink, um, just seem to be uh, spending some time having fun. Uh, okay, and we'll you guys just, tonight. yeah, you guys just barge in. Um, are you attacking or you're, um, um, you guys are attacking? Did we disturb you? And I saw him. <laughs> All right, so yeah, uh, roll initiative. Uh, if you, you oh my uh, God. surprise them. <laughs> 16. <laughs> I got one minus one. No way. So you have zero? <laughs> Good. Um, 16. I have three. Three for Fern. You got what? I got 10. And, and they roll really poorly, actually. Um, so did I. Wait. Is it? Uh, wait. All right. So, Tara, you're in the quickest. Okay, so I'm so going as, to... As soon as uh, like Fern barge in, you uh, sneak past him and just enters the melee. And I'm going to slash the first 
Sky AC. Sorry. Okay. Ooh, that's good. Uh, okay. Yeah. 23. That hits. 23 and... 7 points of damage. All right. And I'm going to just throw the other uh, sword. I'm going to attack with another sword. Where's Fern? Other me. As weird as it is, I'm under the halfling. <laughs> 14. 14? Yeah. That just hits. Ooh! With a do 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 double damage. Where is my die? Uh, oh. Okay, okay, okay. With a Colossus so... Slayer. It's almost more than double. Okay, so four, four, eight, and three. Eleven points of damage. How do you want to do this? Uh, I'm going to just cut the head. Uh, with the Wait. with the two swords, like a scissor. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So you you just like swipe your sword and then cut the the head right off. Oh my like, god! Yeah. <laughs> you don't even bad see, guys. You don't even see it. Yeah, right? you're not even in the room. <laughs> yeah. That's right. You're in Maybe he heard the, like, uh, the head roll. So, next one is Cade. Yeah. I guess uh, I can. Unless, un unless, yeah. But, yeah, you can hear some gory stuff happening. Yeah. But you don't get the details. <laughs> I'm there at it again. You don't, you don't get... more burden me. You don't get the juicy details. Um... Yeah, was it your turn, for, uh, Tamara? Or uh, do you want to... Yeah, that was my turn. Okay, so it, it, it's your turn, Cade. So, I'm entering just after turn. Since he's big, can I be hidden and attack? Um, well, you, could, you can move through true, the yeah. and be here, but you would be at the mercy of this guy as well. And potentially someone here. Yeah. <laughs> you, you cannot be on the same uh, spot as him. You cannot stop on the same spot, but you can move through. You can't okay. jump in the table. Don't. <laughs> in the middle of the four, <laughs> the three mm -hmm. guys. <laughs> That's what I would do, but I'm the tank, not the rogue. I'm gonna go there and shoot this one. Sorry. Roll for attack. But I'm gonna shoot this one. This one? Yeah. Roll for attack. I got 17. Great. That hits. Even shooting through Fern, you would have hit. Whoa. So, since Fern's there, I got sneak attack? Yes. I got 8, plus 3, 11, plus 5. 16 plus 6, 22. <laughs> <laughs> <That's crazy. laughs> um, yeah, how do you want to do this? <laughs> you just, just, just like, shoot him dead. <laughs> you just. So you, uh, you cock your arrow on your, um, your crossbow 
and just uh, shoot him right in the heart. Spare at least one of them. <laughs> and like he's, he's getting, like he gets pinned to the wall and he's kind of like hanging there. Uh, just blood dripping down the wall. Um, okay. Is that your turn? Can I... No, can I still move? Um, you were... You were here, right? Yeah. So, yeah, you still have a bit of mo movement. I'm go back there. And try to hide behind Fern. Well, I mean, there's some, uh, there's some, like, crates or stuff, uh, in the room that you can... Yeah, I can go there uh, if you will. <laughs> Roll, uh, for sneak attack. I got 18 plus 7. Um, like 25? Yep. You feel, uh, you feel like, uh... Nobody can see you. That's my turn. Burn. Right. Burn. Yeah. Wait, it's my turn. Wait, what? Um. Yep. What do I do? What do I do? We have a full turn. I have two left. Okay. Can I kick the table? Does it is it an action if I kick the table? I would say yes. Ah shoot. Um, I'm not gonna kick the table then. I'm just gonna move in front of uh, Tamar. And I'm gonna whack the little guy there. Mm. Whacking, whacking. No, uh, definitely I'm not whacking the guy. With, um, wait, how much is it? I've hit of uh, eight. Eight, eight to it. So, no. That's it. That's the turn? Yep. All right. Uh, next is Sanat. <laughs> so I'll just come here, face palm, and um... face palm. <laughs> Blood everywhere. It's been two. It's been seven seconds. <laughs> just spare at least two, of, one or two of them, please. I'm tired of doing these rituals. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna come here. Come here. And actually, I'm gonna come here. Um, does someone look hurt? Fern always look hurt. Always. It's my rugged he's look. Take, he's uh, taking all the damage for you guys. Fern looks hurt. Uh, I'm never really yeah. full HP that much other than in down. <laughs> like, he has some cuts uh, that you can see that are still uh, kind of bleeding. But uh, you he need, need some healing help. Otherwise... Uh... I'll cast, um, oh my god, it's, you guys are doing it, so, uh, <laughs> have fun, and I'm blessing them again. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, you cast Blessed on Tara, Fran, and Cade? Yep. Alright. Um...
Um, yes. So um, that's gonna okay. be Tamara's turn. Okay. Why do I see something on the turn yeah. order? What is that thing? Okay. Uh, I'm I'm going to to just watch. DM. What have you there. done? I'm going guy to is here. Guy. Yeah, but it looks like a slot. Why is there a slot know. on the turn order? Okay. Let's proceed. I have the bless. You have the bless. She's got okay. the bless. She's got the bless. She's got the bless. So. Uh, 18. Uh, and 18 hits. Okay, and uh, you have damage? Damage, yes. Uh, nope. Damage. Those two are uh, full health at this moment. Uh, too bad. Nope, nobody That's twitched them. Six, uh, nine piercing damage. Alright. And I'm going to hit with my other sword. <laughs> Go for it. <laughs> And Tamara enters the room like in a barber shop. 24. <laughs> 24. <laughs> that hits. That bliss is wow. This is wow. <laughs> <laughs> you don't even need it. And that's it. <laughs> and five, nine, 12 points of person damage. All right. How do you want to do this? I'm going to just Oops. take it off the head again. <laughs> just, uh, so you, like, you, you stab it with one sword, then you just, like, use your other, you do a, a 360, and <laughs> just <laughs> cut the, the head right off. Yay! That's my turn. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Sorry! Sorry, not sorry. What's that thing? So, um, at this point, oh, you okay. see uh, something barge into the door. What is going on here? And he looks at all you guys, um, and um i he doesn't have enough movement to go past here uh, um i guess he could dash he could but he won't be able to attack so at this point he, 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 he's just as he see you guys he's just gonna take a defensive stance so he's gonna use the dodge action and uh, with the door open, there's another what one. What does he look like? And there's another one that bars inside, and he has just enough to reach you, Tamara. Um, oh. It's two bugbears that barge into the room. Freaking bugbears! Makes uh, you can feed like him to the beast. Ah. <laughs> That's what you think right now. Um, so he's gonna take a morning star attack to you with uh, disadvantage. Uh, if you use your reaction, yes. No, with the advantage, she's in a five feet radius of me. Everything that gets attacked in a five feet of me. As disadvantage. Yeah, but, but it's a reaction. No. That's what we. Yeah. It's a reaction. That's what we. I'm pretty sure that's what we, we found out last time. I think it says uh, as a reaction, you can. Um, you you can, can use your reaction to impose his advantage. Oh, right. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. So you, you can do it, but it's once per, uh, per turn. I, I'll use it. All right, so uh, 
with disadvantage. It's gonna be uh, ten. Is it ten? Yeah, ten to hit. Tamara, you're the one ten getting hit. hit. For uh, once, I'm not the one yeah. getting hit. <laughs> no, that doesn't hit. Did you so, say that? Um, yeah. I said ten. Yes. Okay. The disadvantage really helps you. Um, but yeah, he, he takes this big uh, morning star and with the ruckus that the other one did, uh, you notice the two guys coming in and you just uh, are able to step out of the way of the big club coming down uh, to you. And that's going to be the bugbear's uh, turn. And uh, Cade, you're up. I'm gonna shoot with my crossbow. Uh, left. This no, guy? To this guy. To this guy. Nope. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh. I, I guess I can do this one. <laughs> yeah, whatever you want. Okay. Uh, what this one? Uh, I have advantage. Yes, and you're blessed. Damn it. <laughs> I mean, you if you damn miss it? <laughs> at this point, <laughs> you're very unlucky. Oh, I got 19. 19 hits. Roll for damage. Freaking bugbears. Damage. I got uh, six plus three nine plus one ten and one eleven. Damn it. Eleven. What's the total? Eleven. Eleven. Yeah. And I've seen better. Yeah, I know. All right. Is that your turn? I'm gonna hide. Go for it. I got 12. All right. You think you're Eden. It's uh, the red brand turn. So he's gonna, like, at this point, hey, what the fuck? What's happening here? Who are you guys? And uh, he, he, he's just going to draw his sword and hit the, the first person that he's seeing, uh, chopping down all his friends, which is Tamara. Um, and he rolls... Uh, he is completely drunk, so he rolls with disadvantage. Um, that's going to be 7 to hit for the first hit. Next one is... Uh, 16 to hit. 16? Yes. That hit. Alright. It's 3 damage. Oh, okay. <laughs> so yeah, he's, uh, he's pretty drunk. His movement are, um, are sloppy. Uh, but he, he does manage to, uh, uh, surprise you and hits you. Uh, but... Like you kind of are able to dodge kind of past uh, out the, the blow, so it doesn't do that much damage, but still. <laughs> <laughs> are you uh are you keeping track of it on, on the token or you want me to do it or uh... I can do it if you want. Yeah, please. At least put the <laughs> blessing uh yeah, I can. Oh, blessing, uh, yeah. What did we say was blessing? I don't remember. 
I think was the buff was guy. Boop. Ah, uh, yeah, that's good too. Where is this one? Whoa, 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 whoa. All right. Um. So yeah, all the other ones are dead. So that's the uh, red brand's turn. It's fern. Um, he's there, he's there, he's there. Oh boy, starting to regret not having my short rest. Um, let me see, what can I do? And some at your next. Of doing Discord and thinking about your next turn. I know my next turn. <laughs> Good. <laughs> I'm gonna. Uh, 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 I don't really have a choice uh, what to do. I'm gonna try to bash the remaining red brands. Alright. Are you moving around to try and flank or do something like that, or you just uh, staying there? I could flank you. Yeah. I'm in range. All right. Um, that's a roll with advantage oh. plus d4. Okay. Eighteen. That hits. E. And that's seven point of damage. Nice. That's your turn. Uh, I still have some movement, right? Uh, yeah. Uh, I'll move back there on the table right beside the just asserting dominance uh, on, on the table. Doing the, doing the T-pose on the table. <laughs> <laughs> there. All right. Uh, so Matt, you're up. Hello. Impress us. Go. With all your wisdom. So Show I'm me the to, magic. Uh, magic. So I'm going to say... Um... <laughs> We need your help now. Come forth. And um, some like a, a whirlwind of dark fumes gonna start spinning around right here. All right. And um, it's going to kind of rise up and start forming a shape of a scythe uh, that I've posted in the tavern chat as a spoiler. And it's going to be a spiritual weapon. Ooh. Spiritual weapon. I okay, that's why I you didn't said see, wait for I, I, I don't see. It's pointer. Ooh. Ooh. Oh wow, that's fancy. Nice. It's way more fancy than a lollipop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but the lollipop goes with the character. Come on. <laughs> And unicorns and oh, uh, that's so, so it's, cute. I need a token for that, please, Mr. Dungeon Master. Oh boy, um, uh oh, should have told him last uh, week. It, where's the, uh, the where's the last guy? Where's the last bandit? He, he's right, uh, in front of Fern. Oh, he's here. Oh, okay, okay. I thought he had an axe on him. No, that's the guy below. Okay, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. uh, he's going to the weapon. The scythe is actually going to uh, attack the bugbear here in front of Samara. Let me bring out the stat here. 
can't find uh, something that re resemble a site for now, but uh, I'll put just whatever weapon I can find. Oh fuck my demon. No, there's no sight. Uh twelve to hit. I'll put this. Won't work on bug bears. Twelve? Uh that mi that misses. But the sides wipes the air. So the, and... the bug bear just ducks down and you swipe uh right above his head, cutting like just some uh, hair on the top of his head. So you're mo that's moving cool. back out of yeah. the room, and yeah. that's your turn. Exactly. Alright. Um, stop looking stats. There's no stats, by the way, on that. Tamara, you're up. So I'm going to hit the the thing. Well, called? there's still a dude alive here. Right? Yeah. But uh, he's alive. Yeah, he's alive. Yep. Like Britney Spears. Okay, good. I'm alive. Okay, so I'm no, going different to attack first this guy. All right. Move for that. Eighteen. Eighteen hits. He have damage, right? Yep. Nope. Well, Let's I mean, see. yeah. Okay, you're hitting this one, right? It, he does. Yeah, I'm hitting the the red hand. The red hand. Okay. So. Ten points of damage. That's just enough. How do you want to do this? Ooh, today is the day where I'm going to take the head. <laughs> <laughs> and I have... just... I made her violent. It's all my fault. <laughs> I'm saving just... kids and she's the, 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 the mean one now. <laughs> just for today. So you just like purse his stomach and then other sword right in his head. And, and I'm like, no! You no! remove them. <laughs> and he just falls to the ground. Oh, no! It's just for today. Don't worry. Ah. Uh... And that's my turn. Right. You stay there? Yep. Alright. So it's the bugbear's turn. Bugbear! Look at those pussies! They get killed by a woman! And he's gonna... Uh, again, this one... <laughs> is gonna uh, hit you with his morning star again. Um... He doesn't have this advantage this time. It's gonna be eighteen. Eighteen to it. <laughs> Eight. Eighteen. <laughs> it's a bit different. Eight? That hits. Teen. Um, that's my... That's twelve points of damage. Yes. And uh, can this guy? This guy can be on the weapon, right? Your um, spiritual weapon. Uh, yeah, spiritual weapon doesn't occupy a space. No. So it cannot flank, and the guy can move through it. He can stop in it. Okay. Um. 
So the other guy is just gonna uh, move and attack you again tomorrow. Where is he? Okay. After he watch you cut down uh, at least one of his friends, but a similar pattern with at least three others. <laughs> <laughs> um, the next one is you. <laughs> that's a six to hit. A six doesn't hit. All right. That's their turn. Um, it's Gabe. I'll be back in a second. Yes. Uh, I'm going to shoot this one. A crossbow. Go for it. You have advantage? You do. Yes. What? Yes. Yes. You got barely. Eight. You got eight to hit with the D4 and all that? No, with nothing, but. What? I'm good. I'm gonna roll it. Why are you rolling again? Well, I have advantage. Oh! Okay. Just tell me the final one. <laughs> Buy me another set of dice so that you can roll the advantage at the same time. <laughs> There's an advantage that shows the best one, or? Yes. I got 18. That hits. Roll, roll it. Roll it, roll it, roll it, roll it, roll it, roll it. Kevin, do you remember Fievel? Fievel? Fi Fable? Fable? Or what? Uh, 12 damage? Yeah. In total? Yeah, you you rolling low on your damage. Yes. All right, but still, like, um, still the second, like, the guy is buff, but it's still the second arrow that you put inside his chest. And at this point, he he seems to start to look hurt and like, I. Uh, started breathing evilly from like the two arrows that are bleeding from his chest. Is that your turn? I'm gonna hide. All right. I got 17. Good. Um, That's it. Next one is uh, the red brands, which are all dead, and it goes to Fern. Samat, you're up after you're on deck. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. What? Can I do? You said the spiritual weapon doesn't really take any space. Yep. I'm gonna go here. Try to whack. 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 Are we still blessed? Yep. Uh, to be four, and I got advantage. Yep. Oh boy. Uh, 12. That's the top I can do. To hit. Well, uh, wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. 16. My bad. I forgot to add. Yeah, 16. 16 just hit. <sighs> roll. Roll for damage. 
six points of damage. Great. Um, so yeah, you just um, as he's trying to hit Tamara, uh, you go right beside him and whack uh, your big hammer in his back. Um, and you, you feel the resistance. Like the guy is rough and um, it, like you do damage, but it doesn't seem to um, like you, you kind of seem to shrug it off a bit. Okay. And I'm going to move again. There. Sounds good. Sounds good. Send that. Send that pun. This the this one is the most damaged, right? Uh no. That guy. This one. The the guy that has two arrows in his chest is this one. Yeah. This one. Yes. Okay, so uh, spiritual weapon. Yep. It's a bonus action. Yep. And uh, this time it's twenty three. Ooh, that hits. With nine force damage. How do you want to do it? Since the scythe is force damage, uh, it's going to kind of slash through vertically. All right. And it's gonna put some like it's force damage, so. It's gonna just crush him up to the ground, but it's gonna split on the ground. The buddy's gonna split on the ground. So it's not slashing, it's not splitting it to with the weapon, but it's like like crushing him and just keep keep going through the floor so that the buddy kind of crush on the floor and splits on the floor. All right. So you see I'm just uh, you see board. just like. All too. the inside just falls to the ground, and then uh, the body kind of slowly like uh, slide down on the top of all the internal organs and all the stuff that are now laying down on the ground, and two slides of butt bears on top. Hmm. That, that's your turn. Um, no, and like my bonus action. <laughs> True. <laughs> and you guys all look at this like, um, all right, didn't know that this guy t could do that. And mm -hmm. you say me things for slicing yeah, people for like slice that. <laughs> is is there anyone who looks like they seriously need healing in the group? No. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run and you see that Semat is kind of uh, has dark 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 orby eyes now and I'm I'm going to run, bring on the table and um make uh cast inflict wounds. Is it forty sixes? What's the average on that? 46 is 24. Two, okay, so I'm going to cast Inflict Wounds. Um, it's a touch, so I need to have make a melee spell attack. All right. Go for it. And uh, Tamara, I think uh, I didn't uh, track you in the hit point that you, uh, that you got. What the hit point? Uh, like, you got hit... Of twelve, right? Because I, I don't think I, I tracked it. Nineteen. Do you know what what's your hit point right now? Right now, my current uh, hit points is sixteen. Sixteen. Okay. Yeah. I'll just put it in. Great. I I guess nineteen hits. It does hit. Did I say nineteen? You did. Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, nineteen. Yes. So it's gonna be. Um, 15 necrotic damage. 
Wow. Fifteen. So uh, there's gonna be a skull, uh, a dark skull in my head that I'm just bringing uh, to his chest, and the skull like gets into his chest, and dark veins start, you know, like in the, it has an internal impact on his, on his blood vessels. It, there's quick. There's a like the dark mark, a burnt mark, but it's not burnt. Okay. So you, you you see the the bug spare uh, body just like stiffen for a uh, short uh, burst and then uh, relax again and he seems like almost to kneel down and take back his um his uh, balance but uh, yeah he looks very hurt at this point he's breathing heavily and. Uh, He's spitting blood on the ground, dark tick blood. Um, oh, I had an advantage on that. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> um, you know. Yep. Is that your turn? Yep. Good. Oh wait, is Fern going before Tamara or Tamara first? Tamara is going next. Good. <laughs> Tamara. Okay, so I'm going to hit the guy. Go for it. And eight. <laughs> We're hit. With, with advantage and the d4? Without advantage, so I can roll again. Ooh. Yes. Sixteen. Sixteen just hits. Yay. I suggest you make the, your second attack if you want to make your second attack. Uh, and roll damage all at once. It's going to be faster. Okay. The damage is. Uh, 14. With advantage? Oh, it's no, she was damage. 14 the damage. is the damage. Okay. Yeah. yeah. But it does it anyway. So, uh, yeah. <laughs> How do you want to do the next one? I'm going to take the head. <laughs> <laughs> Finishing move. Just, Taking head. Just off. going from one to the other, and I'm just spinning around, chopping heads. Like all around, you just see a, a real wind of uh, a real wind of uh, blood and uh, steel going around, uh, and some of the blood is black. Oh, yeah. after the necrotic damage. So yeah, for some of you that weren't in the melee, like Cade, you just see real wind, <laughs> real wind of. <laughs> Feel and blood going and heads and like everything just going all uh, around. This is fun. <laughs> I might say we uh, kind of kick ass, but uh, we, we kind of went over our heads, didn't we? So much for keeping someone alive. And I'm looking at all the mess on the ground. <laughs> Which you can sure you did too. There, there, there's just one thing, guys, to uh, to uh, take care of. We didn't clean this house yet. You ready? So I'm, I'm while my spiritual weapon is up, I don't want the encounter to end, and I'm going to open that door. All right. And scream. Uh, the meat's here, buddy. Want to help? And kind of throw a head in the corner here. So what do I see? Um, what I mean, it's it connects uh, here. So yeah, that's right. You okay, throw, so a head, throw a head here. You you s beast. you see kind of a a hand just just the hand uh, past the corner, grab the There's head. More here. And you start just like you hear it. Yeah. Okay, so uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to 
bring um uh i'm going to but it's 20 feet one two three four i'm going to come here do i see it uh yeah at this point it would be um it would be just around the corner eating okay so can i can i move through it or is it an enemy um i would say well i mean are you guys still in combat that's what you you meant i would like you to want... stay in combat for this because i don't well, want my spiritual weapon to end um well yeah i would say no you can't really like move past it okay so i'm going to i'm going to cast uh, uh cast guiding bolt what the second uh no i can't okay a guiding bolt at this creature you're going to kill the creature yep okay. yep 19. i was gonna suggest it but mm -hmm. 19 hits <laughs> so 15 radiant damage and all right I bring my uh, spiritual weapon with my bonus action where, right where I am. I'm making an attack with my spiritual weapon. Go for it. That's it. Okay. Uh, Fifteen. Fifteen just hits. Nine force damage. No. Nine. Nine. So as he was, you uh... just see me like casting a bunch of dark, dark skulls that spikes through the the the. Uh, no, it's not dark skulls. It's like light skulls. that are very, very, very radiant. There's a there's a and they merge together in front of me and it spikes to the beast that you hear scream. <laughs> And the the weapon just the side just go and thrash, slash another time on the beast. <laughs> All right. Um. It wasn't really your turn though. Um. Sorry. Um, <laughs> I just realized that like you you just took two turns. Almost back to back. Oh yeah. Well, I'm yeah, because you you were just before Tamara, and then Tamara killed it, and then. Uh, I consider that we finish. Yeah, but well, I um, moved, um I but made, like it, I, I made my movement. I didn't go, th like in a round, I could have been I'd done everything I just did. So, I don't know. There was an order of things or. Yeah, no, uh, I think we're just gonna uh, start again. Like, let's say we took a round to just like, um, uh, uh, like, show the head round. and, yeah, right. kind of. Um, so that would put us to Tamara again. Okay, so the creature is still alive. So, yeah. So I can't do anything there. Uh, well, I you can... can try to attack it. It just has partial cover. Okay, but I can attack with the with the with the sword. Yes. Yeah. Okay. To so try and pick, like uh, stab him. Around the corner. I was gonna say, or you can stay in the room, hold an attack until somebody comes back in the room because we're fighting a freaking corridor. But can't you uh, misty step? 
Could, couldn't you like teleport here? Uh, yes or no, because I don't have Mrs. Step. I, I already use it. Oh. So, and I think I Even with the short rest? Because it's once per short rest. Is it short rest or long rest? It's a short rest. Uh, once per short. For sure? Oh, so short, I have a short rest. But this thing the, didn't take it. Okay, so. But Misty Step is just like a reaction? Um, it's a bonus it's action. It's a bonus action. Okay, so I'm going to use it for jump here. Yeah, but if, if you do that, you can't attack twice. Because okay. attacking twice is a bonus action. No, but she's still attacking with the Colossus Slayers anyway. Yeah. Okay. So, so you're still blessed. And, okay. and I have, have, a you have advantage. And you have 1d8 you... bonus damage. Okay. Nine. Denied. Nine. With advantage? With advantage? With advantage. Yeah. With advantage and the D4. And everything. Oh, no. <laughs> so you just uh, pay for it back and uh, like Semat is just like throwing magic at it, uh, hitting it, and like it, you, you start seeing that this is a quick creature and uh, you 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 attempt to hit it, but like it's not that big like a bugbear or uh, a, a human and it, it like, gets out of the way. Oh. Look at you with his big high. You cannot chop Hello, its head. We. I know the we. You do we. Um, and, I, and I cannot do move because uh, he's going to attack me. Um, sorry? Yeah, if you move, he, he's going to attack you. So, yeah, I'm going to stay there. All right. Um, Got no spells left. Uh, actually, I didn't roll any shit for this guy. So now it's the turn of Kate. Um, it's gonna be uh the creature turn actually. Oh fuck! You roll nineteen initiative. Um, all right, so uh, this guy looking at uh, Senat, like just throwing what everything that he has at, uh, at him, he's gonna take uh, he's gonna do rotting gaze, which is a DC 12 constitution saving throw. I'm looking at my saving throws. Okay. <laughs> Eight. No. Um. You take nine points of necrotic damage. Just uh, like E. He looks at you and like you you uh, like you match his sight and like everything you, you kind of lose yourself in his eye and uh, for a moment you you're not in your body anymore and he he just like in another dimension it seems to you he just like uh, hits you with everything he's got and then you come back and you just feel awful. I take my head and ah, got them creatures. And he's gonna turn around and hit Tamara with his claw, which is um, maybe sixteen to hit. 
that hit? It's nine uh, points of slashing damage. Okay. Seven points of damage. And uh, at that point, next up, uh, the, the the door right next to you, uh, Samat, just slams open. Oh, fuck. What is <laughs> going on here? Oh, what is all this noise? <laughs> and uh. There's another bugbear that is going to take a swing at you. I start to scream, <laughs> Which oh, There was is... a door. There was a door. Um, oh, fuck. It's uh, 15 to hit. Uh, miss, uh, no, just hits. I don't see your armor class, uh, but 15. All right. It's 12 points of damage. Oh, fuck. And Kate, you're up next. Shoot okay. from afar. From afar? Yeah, uh, don't, um, don't go in the corridor. We're going to be stuck. Yeah, I'm Did retreating. You... Ne next next turn, I'm, I'm getting the hell out. Like, I'm retreating. Here. As far as I can. Did, did you uh, enter the damage that you took? Yeah, you can see my... Wait, it doesn't... Yeah, I don't know what's happening. I, like, every... All of your square or or, or circle are... Uh, gone. Alright. Um, Alright, so, um... So, yeah, it, it's uh, Kate's turn. Yeah. I'm gonna stay at the end of the corridor and shoot the bugbear. All right. He will have plus two to AC uh, because of Samet in front of him. Are you still blessed? You are. No, it's a concentra concentration. So oh, since yeah. Samet took damage, you should have. Uh... You need to to oh, make two. Right. You mean you need to make two constitution. Saving throw. Uh, For blessed. Same up. Two constitution saving throws. What? You got hit twice. For, so if you want to keep blessed. Oh. <laughs> I got 15 DC, and... DC 10. And 12. Nice. You guys keep uh, the bless. So yeah, uh, so Cade, it's straight roll, uh, plus a d4. I got 11. Even total? Did I miss you say there was a yes. door? Um. Oh man. I didn't play right. I didn't play my character right. <laughs> so, 11? Yep. 11 misses. So, uh, trying to uh, aim uh, the bugbear behind Senat, uh, you try to hit and uh, you it just goes wide above its, uh, its head. Uh, so, uh, 
Move there. And can I hold? Uh, well, you already use your action. So you want to hold not dashed. Well. You cannot hold the bonus action, I don't think so. Okay, so I'm gonna stay there. You could try to hide though, if they are coming back in I the room. Can... I hide Actually, there. You're holding a reaction, so it's cost an action to hold and a reaction also to do it. I'm gonna hide. Alright, roll stealth checks. I got 11. Okay. All right. That's it. Uh, next up is Fern. Um, hmm. Get out of that corridor, and I'm gonna. I will. Hold an attack with a crossbow as soon as the corridor is clear, so I can shoot any anything that is in the first target in the corridor. All right. Uh, so if that ends your turn, Semat, you're up. So, um, uh, disengage. All right. Does it work on all the monster guy uh, around you, or just one? All monsters. Okay. Um. And... So for at this point, Fern gets his reaction, unless you. Uh, yeah. Well, I think... Fern get Fern gets his reaction, and I'm gonna use his bonus action afterwards. Yeah. And we're still blessed, right? Yes. And I shoot wide with a five. So your inexperience with uh, crossbow at this point uh, shows as you try to hit the bug bear, but um, with the sight that is still in front of it and everything that it is happening, you just shoot past him. He looks right. at you. Mm. Oh man. And uh, uh, <laughs> bonus action for me. Yes, go for it. With the spiritual weapon, I'm going to keep high, uh, hitting the creature, the the aberration monster whatever. Yes. Uh, the one-eyed beast. <laughs> with uh, did you do it with advantage? I can't. You can't. The Nope. You mean because Tamara is there? I yeah. don't think it counts that as nope. flank. No, it doesn't count. Okay, with the spiritual weapon, it doesn't count as flanking? Yep. Okay, okay, okay. So, 13? On uh, the creature? No. Yeah. 13 misses. This one? Shit, man. They're hard. <laughs> All right. So that's that your almost dead on this. Run, uh, Tamara! Run! Tamara. Get to the chopper! Uh, I can jump. I, I, I can jump uh, into the creature, right? I can. I can. Uh, you, uh, you can't pass uh, him. You could try and shove him out of the way and then like, sneak around uh, the corner. But you would have to push him. It would take your action. I think I'm going to uh, disengage exactly, and I'm going to run that way. All right. So uh, you can get <laughs> as you can get as far as um, as far as I can. Let us thirty feet. Wait. Twenty-five. Thirteen. Um, where do you get? I don't know. Here. I yeah, 25? 
Yeah, you, you can get either here or here. Okay, here. She got 30. I'm going to take, I'm going to take the 30 feet. The what? I'm going to take the 30 feet because I have 30. And... Take the, uh, sorry, I, I didn't get what you meant. Take the terror with it. No, I'm going to I'm going to run just the the t theory, th thirty. Ter okay, th thirty. 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 Feet. 30. 30 thank you. Thirty feet, and I'm going to stay there. All right. Um. All right. So. The. Uh, so up next is the creature, which uh, is gonna follow Samat. I wonder why. And um, yeah, actually, it's gonna as he passed by uh, here. He notices he no, notices uh, Cade trying to hide because his passive perception is higher than your poor roll, and he's gonna uh, look into your eye. Um, so you want to hide, and uh, he's gonna use his running gaze. You're blessed. You can you have a D4 or... on your saving throw, Max. A DC 12 constitution save. Oh, you, you, have, you have a D4 also on your saving throw for that. I use the D12 and a D4? You no, use you a D20 are... and a D4. It's a constitution saving throw, so you should see bonuses for saving throws uh, the, on, on your character sheet. Constitution is not too great. I got five. Five. <laughs> <laughs> you fail. Oh, uh, that's a, that's where we fail everything. That's where everybody dies. Um. So it is eight points of damage. Yay. Are you putting it in row 20 or you want me to do it? I can do it. Is that eight? And... Sorry? Uh, Is yeah, that eight. 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 And he's gonna take his other attack at you with his claw. It's, um, uh, 11. 11 to hit. 11? Sorry? 11 to hit? Yes. Miss. All right. So he, he looks you into the eyes and like you are also dragged into the void. You experience it. Very weird, uh, swift dream where you kind of beaten down to the uh, pulled by this creature, and then you come back to reality and you, you feel tired. Uh, but then um, you see it just like uh, his claw coming at you, and you have the time to just uh, uh, duck out of the way after this uh, painful experience, and you uh, dodge out. Yes. The creature does rotting gaze and then attacks. Does it have two actions for that? Um. Oh yeah, right. That's what I thought. The D the DM is out for no. blood. Because usually there, that's a uh, legendary action or something when he can do the act. Or there's a yeah. There's a you know. No, he adds multi attack, but multi attacks is two claws. So if you do road gaze, you cannot do anything else. That's right. So yeah. Um, sorry. Uh, I mean the the claw didn't hit, but uh, 
Tamara, you shouldn't have been hit by the claw. Just uh, Samat. By the gaze. Okay. Yes. Um, what I should do? No. The last um, damage you took. Why? It's okay. fine. Yeah. Nine, I think? Nine. Uh, no. Because uh, the clause is just 1d6 plus 3. I, I don't think I rolled a 6. I don't remember how much I rolled. Um, yeah, I remember it was a 9. It was 9? So 6 plus 3? Uh, the damage. Or no? Mm. <laughs> it, it, is what, it was 9 by the bugbear on Senat, but I don't think it was 9 on you. Um, well, no. But, uh, yeah, I mean, it doesn't matter. You, you can put back nine. Um, okay. Hmm. Alright. Yep. Uh, okay. good to know. So, next up is the bugbear. And he's gonna... He's gonna come here and uh, attack Fern. I'm coming. Which is... Uh, 16 to hit. Misses. Nice. The big morning star just like comes to you slams on your shield as you raise it to protect yourself. Um, so yeah, that's the only thing you can do. He's gonna... Uh, so he's gonna be Cade your turn. Oh. You yes. want to move away, you get you a could... bonus action to disengage. That's what I was going to say. Yeah, but I can attack him. Yeah, but you can disengage, you can get away. Move away. Yeah. If you do a range attack in uh, melee range, or yeah, you can attack with your card start, I guess, but you cannot. If you attack with a, a range weapon in melee distance, I think you have disadvantage. You can use oh, your sword right. and then run away. But you can use yes. your bonus action to disengage so you don't get any reaction and just no, go away. I got, I got skill so I don't get attacked. I have fancy footwork, so... If you make a melee attack against a creature, that creature can make opportunity attack against you for the rest of your turn. Nice. So I can attack him and I'll run. Yep. Just out to not miss him. <laughs> you still have Bless? Yes. Mm, yep. Yes. Okay. I got natural one. <laughs> For I'm gonna roll again. Can you <laughs> you roll those damage? <laughs> Do you re roll again for also attacks? Yes. Okay. I got a natural twenty. Nice. Finally. <laughs> it's been a long time since we've had a natural twenty, actually. So, it um, it does hit. The natural 20. Um, it's so what is it, Joe, again? Dommage. For, uh, crit. Oh, you roll twice the amount of dice you would roll oh, yeah. usually for damage. You take the highest one, and you multiply by two. So you double it. So let's say you okay. get... 
Uh, what about the... 3d6 damage, you roll 6d6, you get th the th three highest, and you double it. So, I don't think I can do my sneak attack. Damn it. Um, why? Because there's a monster beside it. Um, yeah, I know. I don't remember. I think I saw something like that. What does it say again? <laughs> we sneak it back? Don't need advantage on the attack roll if another enemy of the target is within 5 feet of it. That enemy so isn't in... You can sneak attack at this point. Yeah, you can. If you don't have a disadvantage. Because Fern is there? Yeah. Yeah, Fern is there. Okay. So, Wait. what's your so, weapon? I got a short sword. So, 1d6. What's your sneak attack yes. uh, bonus uh, damage? 2d6. 2d6, so you get 3d6. Yay. And you don't get any other bonus. So, it's 3. You shoot 6d6, you take 3 IS, and you double it. <laughs> I have only it. one d6. <laughs> Stop rolling. Or take roll 20 yeah, for this some. one. Five. Two. So, wait, you said... What? Five. Just roll Six. them. Roll them. Yeah. Go for it. Roll them and I'll note them now. Five, six, two, four, three. Again. Five, six, two, four. So you get yeah. two times again. Two more. Oh, you get two more on. D6. That's, that's what I got Just... now. So I got one. Okay. Last one. And four. Four. So four, five, six. Yep. That's fifteen. So you get thirty damage from that. But I still have plus three. Yes. For the short sword. And then you add your plus three. Oh. So thirty-three. Thirty-three. Please yep. kill it. That's fun. <laughs> Please kill it. I'm the one to do this. Woo. Fuck yeah! 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 Hey! Oh my god! Oh, I was thinking. I'm just gonna guy. pierce him in the middle of his chest and look him fall to the ground. Fix All his right. big eye, fixing you, shaking. Who's looking at who's now? <laughs> <laughs> Alright. We still have a so... bugbear, by the way. Oh, no. Is that your turn? Or you want to hide again or move or Yes I'll move. Move. Uh, well I can go there and try to hide again. Yep. <laughs> that corner. <laughs> Glorious corner. <laughs> I got 19. Great. After all, 20 are fun. These natural 20s are fun. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Wait, wait until a monster got one, get one though. Yeah, it's heavy. Yeah. <laughs> Um, all right, so kids, uh, turn is done. Fern, yay! I'm gonna so, whack him. Did you want to do something else, uh, Kate, or you were gonna say something? Nope, that's all. Nope. Okay, Same whack him. It was over. I'm not gonna whack him. I know already. Nope. I won't. Yeah. <laughs> Twelve. With the D4. With the D4. Uh, wait, 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 wait. No, no. Wait. Ooh, I forgot. I heard one dice. One, one die. No, I no. Uh, one uh, 12, 17, my bad. 
Oh wait. Wow. Wrong wrong one. Wait, 16. <laughs> 16 just hit. Yay! Roll it. Five points of damage. Nice. After after Kate doing 32. <laughs> That's not. My role is not to do damage. My role is to absorb it. Um. All right. So, is that your turn? Yes. Come up. You're up. Camera, you're next. So, um, I'm going to dash. No, well, I mean, you're next okay, after. I'm going there to there. Okay, next, yeah. sorry, sorry. Sorry. Um, so I'm going to do Sacred Flame. Which is DC of Wisdom. Is it Wisdom or it's uh, Dex? No, sorry, it's Dex. Told the Dead. Told the Dead. Told the Dead. Told the Dead. Till literally, it is Wisdom saving throw. Um, three. <laughs> uh, so the same, same, same thing. Uh, two necrotic damage. And I move my spiritual weapon over right. here. Kill them. And I do a spiritual weapon attack. All right. What? Uh, roll for attack. Walking good. It's a miss, I think, with the 12. It misses. So he, he shrugs off like the the flame, doing a bit of damage, but not that much. And then <laughs> looks looks at the side coming through his right and um, just dodge the blow. You're gonna so. die anyway, fucker! Don't you see? <laughs> you're stupid, man. Camera, you're up. Okay, so I'm going to dash. This. You're using. You're using the dash action? Yeah. Yeah, because okay. if, if not, I'm going to take so while to get there. And I can take a Oh, yeah. Okay. You're going back there, right? Yeah. But I, but I cannot take a bonus action, right? Uh, you can. Yeah, you can. So you move, you dash, you can make a bonus action. Okay, so but, I, I, I can. All right. move. Do you stay over the corner or? Mm, no, I'm going to. to, to I, I think uh, 60 is here. But attack. you can't attack with your bonus action. I can attack? Ah, no. No. So I'm going to weapon fighting here. is when you can you make the uh, attack action. Okay. No. So I'm going to stay there and wait for the next turn if the guy. To the next turn. All right. So yeah, the next up is the bugbear. Um. So he's looking at at Fern, trying to uh walk him. Um, walk him all. And he's gonna take a swing with his morning star, trying to go past his helm. And it's fifteen. Uh... Fifteen misses. Bing. Bing. Uh, shield again. And it's Kate's turn. Yeah. I'm gonna Do shoot him magic. with my crossbow. <laughs> Do your magic. <laughs> Go for it. Natural twenty. Advantage. Bless. And a D8. Uh, D4. D4. So two D D20, you pick the highest one, D4 added to that. Uh, 
I got 22 to hit. Yeah, hit. 15 plus 2 plus 5. Yay! Kill it! Kill it! <laughs> got 7. Plus 3, 10. Plus 5. <laughs> Or 19. <laughs> I'm smashing that sweet girl. <laughs> 19. Uh, you, like, you hit it, um, like, right in the chest. And he looks at uh, the arrow. Um, it's well placed, but he's still standing. He's, ble he's bleeding profusely. Uh, probably hit the stomach. And he's he's gonna stomach. die from it. Stomach. 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 Uh, stomach. 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 It's a cousin of the tomato. It's a too much. <laughs> you done? <laughs> We're done. I'm gonna hide. Go for it. I almost died. Give me that. <laughs> <laughs> well, it was I your fault. <laughs> Remember that. <laughs> hey, you never mentioned there was a door there. Well, I mean, uh, they all look the same. <laughs> um, how much did you get? Well, well, good. So it's Fern's turn. Whack him! <laughs> because it rhymes. Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. If I move here, hey, here, hey, here, no, can't. Oh, wait, right. here. Yes. Do I get flanking? I think so. It, it works with the diagonal, right? So that is Waking. Yeah, he's sleeping. Power uh, what? Flanking what works. Uh, uh, I was looking at good. my dice. <laughs> so that I is... Uh, if I'm moving, flanking... Works. Flanking, yeah. flanking works on the diagonal, right? He's not listening to anything what he's saying. Are you gonna say anything? I'm asking you a question. What did you ask me? Come <laughs> on. It's been five times. If flanking Thanks. works Sorry. diagonal. It's midnight, man. It's Sorry. 1 a.m. for me. Fuck, you uh, decided to go there. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, the question is. Flanking works in a diagonal, right? Uh, yes. Okay. Good. Roll with advantage. <laughs> uh, well, I already have like 17, 18. Oh, wait. Are you, are you, is the question Fern and Tamara flanking? Because they're not. They have to be at the opposite side. So Fern would need to be here. How? No, the bugbear here. There's no way they can flank him then. Uh, well, he if he gets on the barrels. But she's yeah, but there. Tamara is here. Oh no, sorry. I thought the bugbear was. Here. I can't see red squares. Okay. Sorry. So, so, if, yeah. if Fern needs is here, then he would be flanking. They need to but be Tamara, opposite Tamara side. is here. It wouldn't be flanking. Yes. But if they want to flank that bear, bug bear, they need to be at the opposite sides. Exactly. Yeah. But Tamara is. The flanking position is here. Yeah. But Tamara is in the corner, so there's no way he can flank her. Well, he can get on the barrel. Yeah, but. Yeah, but it, Tamara... it won't work? Yeah. Tamara, I. I see Tamara here, okay? No, she's, she's not. not. I'm here. She's there. She's here. You're, well, I see your your 
Whoa. Okay, now, now, okay. Now they're flanking. Ah. Oh, okay. But in the, the diagonal works, it's just that you are not seeing her in the right place. Now I'm seeing her in the right place. Okay. Good. I don't know why I didn't 18. see her. 18? 18 to hit. The hits. Please die. Uh, it's like beating a legend uh, dragon uh, boss. Uh, 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 <laughs> Ooh! Three points of damage. Whack! <laughs> Whack them all! <laughs> Whack! How do you want to do this? Uh, oh shit! I'll bash his skull oh, in. Yeah. Whack! <laughs> it's yours. It's yours tonight. Mm. Hey, we first kill of the night. Kill so you just whack him good? I'll just you whack, whack him, him real good. I'll whack, whack him, him real good. good. <laughs> just like with his armor. Doink, doink. Just uh, beating his head to a pulp with your hammer. Um, that's it, guys. You're just taking yeah. my place at the table and Everything. start drinking. <laughs> So just drinking, like, just drinking a beer that was started by a nobody. Yeah, yeah. Let's, at this point, <laughs> they're not gonna take it anymore. Let's just take a drink. So there's, yeah. um, since Fern stepped on the table, there's maybe like one beer left uh, that is not spilled that you can take right away. But otherwise, you can uh, certainly find some barrel of uh, ale and pour oh, uh, yeah, a drink for doing. every. Right okay, yeah. barrel. Okay, I, I thought you were just picking up a glass from the table that uh, well, if there's the barrels other guys. Of beer I'm taking from the barrel. There is other. Yeah, there is. A Give me a fresh... choice, man. I'm gonna take the. Yeah. All right. <laughs> No, but uh, for the uh, narrative, I just thought like as soon as it ends, we just chug and like the first thing that you see on the table, <laughs> even though well, it's actually, like it's, it's actually, I'm, by... I'm, I start doing that, and I'm I, I'm about to take a sip, and from the corner of my eye, I spot a barrel. I'm throwing the barrel away. I'm I'm going to the right at the barrel. <laughs> Good. Um. All right. Oh, Senpai, did we have any XP? Well, I mean... Give, give us an oh, XP? oh boy. We can do that next week, no? <laughs> yeah, I think uh, it's going to take me some time because I need to calculate the, the XP for the whole dungeon. Because <laughs> we didn't... I don't, I, I don't think we calculated anything in last week for um, for the skeleton. I don't think so. Uh, no. No. So it's, like, for, it's for yeah. the whole dungeon. And it's yes, per encounter, so the more we tackle things together, the higher the XP, I think. We just cleaned that dungeon. I don't know, but the reward, it's kind of fucked up. I'm not sure but I'm Just following. so you know, guys, <laughs> I, I did the math. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I, I, I did some math. <laughs> and one, one monster like this, plus two bugbears... Okay, it is a deadly encounter for yeah, but us. How, how often uh, have we done deadly encounters and we're still all alive? That's what I don't get. <laughs> <laughs> we're very lucky, I think. Yeah. But I spent but the everything. Last, the last was, uh... I, I don't think you guys all could have. All my spells went into that, that fight, man. Yeah, I don't think you guys could have done anything else. Um, but yeah, uh, it was impressive. You guys just gore your way through the whole thing. <laughs> like, at the end, it wasn't even funny at the end. <laughs> it was just like, no emotion, just like, yeah, just... Ah. Uh, we're just killing everything. everything. <laughs> Uh, thank you guys. So uh, it, I, I knew that going after the monster kind of alone was a risk, but my, my character was willing to take it because of what he's just seen, like 
before with the uh, with the with the you know the mo actually he learned that the monster was had uh, desecrated the corpse of the husband of the family so it, it it got to him at a point where he started to be less careful but in my defense that door would have changed things i wouldn't have done i wouldn't have busted in if that door if i knew there was a door there <laughs> yeah. but to my defense we, you guys were still in uh initiative like it wasn't yeah. really like perception or anything that you guys were it looking went for. really fast and it was uh it was a bit like... we thought that we were done that was the the thing we were like oh okay we killed the guy so the next one is going to be easy yeah no but uh in the end like you guys did very well uh but yeah i guess Nat That's 20. Be all almost. because of that one Nat 20, man. Mm, I think would yeah. have, would I, maybe some of us would have fallen. I still have Spare the Dead, which, you like, like if someone falls, I can stabilize them. And we still got our potions of healings, which is yeah. good. So we could, like, revive each other, worst case scenario. So I, I, had, I had that in mind before going in. But, uh, yeah, it was. Uh, <laughs> Bad choices. Well, yep. guys, thank you very much. Yep. Thanks, everyone. Thank See you next you. week. See you next See week. You. I'll, uh, I'll uh, calculate the XP and uh, you guys will be able to go through the dungeon and uh, see if you find some loot. All right. Yay. Yay. See you. Uh, I'm, uh, my